In any case, hi everyone. I'm gonna be playing a bit more Witcher 3 today. As I feel like I'm close-ish to being almost done with the with the DLC here, with the expansion Hearts of Stone. So, we'll see. Uh, we'll see if I can uh, if I can finish it today, which would be great. Like that, we could uh, start on uh, the other one last time. <laughs> Man, just thinking about it, a sex doll on a used sale. Ah, oh. ooh. I mean, just a sex doll, to be honest, it's just like... Like, if... I don't know, I just... You need to be really sad to go that far, to go there, right? Or, I don't know, unless it's like a joke or... I don't know, it just... What, what's the point, really? There are a lot of fast travel points in this game, holy crap. In any case... Uh, uh, yeah, I did all the... Uh... Oh, right, we have two... Uh... Yeah, right, uh, we finished the first uh, part. So now we have the uh, the second one. Let's, let's do that. We had a really nice time with, with Shani. Again, don't tell you anything about it. Did I, uh... Yeah. Can I go over there? Oh, yeah. Come on, Roach. Ooh, can I even go through this? I can. Why is the GPS telling me I can? Freaking lying to me. It's okay. And can just go over there. How are you doing today, Cryphon? You managed to get some sleep? Mm. I'm really happy we finished the uh, Borderlands pre-sequel. Which means, what games can we play now? I need to find more games. I need to continue EDF at some point too, actually. I'm waking up a lot though. That's it, Roach. Mm. Yeah, well. I really hope uh, it fixes itself at some point, but man, must be pretty used to it by now. As inconvenient as it is. Stuck everywhere. What was? All oh, right. He wants me to get the house. Ah, uh, yeah. I remember now. I remember. Hey ya. Hey ya. Let's go, Geralt. Man, I am so impressed on how fast Amazon is when it comes to shipping. Like, both of my items got shipped already. Like, right like this morning, literally a few hours after me, like, ordering it. In the middle of the night. So... That's, that's pretty impressive to me. Mm. 
you. No, I'm really looking forward to get that uh, new SSD. And finally have tons of uh, tons of space. Hell yeah. Well, double what I have here actually. So yeah, kind of uh, kind of big. I think to reinstall Windows. Uh. You try returning. Yeah. It really uh, is. I did hear a lot of bad things about Amazon and how they treat uh, their employees. Uh. Kind of sucks. Greetings again. See if I can uh, sell stuff. Show me what. I don't know what I have, but I probably have some stuff to sell. Uh, no, I don't. Oh. So long. So long. Alright, let's go get that uh, that house. Still so quick saver. Yeah. This the Brasodi Brothers auction house? Seems it. Private Kleiner, you're on duty. Need I remind you? Fraternizing with civilians is not allowed. I just asked the question. He replied. How is that fraternizing with civilian? You're doing the exact same freaking thing. You're even asking. What the heck is wrong with you, man? Just curious. Redanian army regulars, right? Lance Corporal Vaclav reporting. And this bloke's my subordinate, Private Kleiner. Hey, you cannot fraternize. Excitement. You say something, soldier. Not a thing. Should I like this guy. Somewhere. There's a war on, you know. We was transferred here. All official. Written order 76 CWX. Mission guard the auction house. Priority high. Top, in fact. Borsodi fella knows his way about the court. Helps the high ranking sell the war booty. <laughs> Gets protection in return. Private Kleiner, that's confidential military information. <laughs> Any of the owners home? Meaning the one and sole owner, the esteemed host Besodi. Aye, he is. Need to talk to him. Order 76 CWX is clear. Auctions only open to folk with invitations. Writ out in their names, plain and simple. It'd be smart to make an exception. Let's go with... Uh, I'm not gonna pick up a fight with those guys. Let's go with... Gonna shall we can? Hold you back. Come on. Why am I not using my Witcher thingy here? Order 76 CWX <laughs> also held that Lance Corporal Vatslav stick a broomstick up his ass. Kleiner, need I remind you of the penalty for insulting a superior? Who have we here? Geralt, the Witcher of Rivia! Vimy Vivaldi, the banker from... Actually, where are you from? Matters little, mate! I remember this guy in Witcher 2. Vivaldi. Well... This is was Witcher 1 and not Witcher 2. Your esteemed associate, he weren't invited to the auction and I've... But I plow and have been, and he's coming with me! In you go, Geralt! But that's not him, though. It must be another Vivaldi one. But my orders... Fuck your orders! Need I take this up with the sergeant? Ha! I thought not. No! Stand to attention! And shut your giggy! Oh, the lads will be rolling back at the barracks. Sort it! Now march! Round you go! One, two, one, two! Mm-hmm. Doffs are pretty good, yeah. Appreciate the help. Just night. Always had a mind to see into old pals and clients. Business with you's a pure pleasure, Vimmy. The dear departed wifey claimed the same. Ah ha! Folk are assembling. Auction's about to start. Time we went upstairs. Um What did folks like bid on? Any idea? All kinds of valuables. Rare weaponry, exotica. 
but I've got my eye on a selection of canvases by the master portraitist of the Maribor school. Van de Neu, long indeed. Well, well. Never knew you to be a connoisseur. Of course I'm not. It's all muck and rubbish <laughs> to me. Point of fact, I'll just wrap them in paper and lock them in the vault. Why in the world do... What do you mean, why, Geralt? I've got to diversify my investments, didn't I? <laughs> Could have sworn the Borsodi's auction house was in Novigrad. It was, but they moved it. You see, Radovid offered Horst a preferential tax rate. Zero percent. Huh. Pretty much unbeatable. Mm -hmm. And I've never seen a purer example of the benevolent state. Actually, I'm really just here to talk to Horst Borsodi. Oh, might be more of a problem than you'd expect. Because? An awful hermit, that one. Not a wee bit like his da, my little keep his soul. But Horst is like to show his heed during the auction. I'll introduce you then. Be mighty indebted. Thank to you. you. Think nothing of it. Only ever clicked on loans and promissory notes. <laughs> All right, up we go. How nice of you, uh... And mother of pearl with Why did you go around there? Let's check stuff uh, here. Yeah. A giant's. Or maybe a Jotun's. Hmm? From the collection of the mage Aramis. Is that a piece of cheese? Does look like it. Codex Redaniensis. Sole surviving copy. Ooh, that's fancy, uh... Fancy stuff. Spears. Excellent adornments for any parlor wall. <laughs> Good to know. There is a horse. <gasps> is that a unicorn? This one probably also belonged to sorceress. Fetish, maybe? <laughs> Beautiful. But first blow would shatter them. I don't see what this thing is. Oh, it's a sword, okay. Dress of harky silk trimmed with amethyst. Uh, yes. Alright, let's, let's continue. Price of 2,000 crowns. Geralt, you thought of buying real estate. Could get you attractive terms on a mortgage. No such thing as attractive loan terms, Vimy. What about in Kavir? What? Hmm. It didn't even finish the... Uh, start for a time yet, it uh, seems. Sorry. Vimy, this is a banquet. Aye? And? I detest banquets. Vacuous conversation, food portions fit for a mouse, drinks that taste like piss. Ah, it won't all be bad. Let me introduce you to some of my most interesting associates. All right. Old hand there is Countess Mignol. Wager you'll have plenty to blather about with her. <laughs> Prick in the corners, Hilbert. New coin, that one. Came into a right fortune playing Gwent. Ah, there's Yaramir, art dealer. A purer snob I've never known. But he knows paintings like no other. So, ready to chat someone up? It's not fitting for us to stand here like knobs. <sighs> okay, let's go talk to uh, to everyone here. Oh, He's the one that says that I uh, played a lot of Gwent, right? Greetings to the Honorable Countess. Madam, allow me to introduce my dear friend, Geralt of Rivia. No, it's probably not her. School of the Wolf. Oh, forgive us. But have we had the pleasure? No, but your guild is unmistakable. Your medallion. Take mm -hmm. note, Geralt. Countess Mignol is an eminent collector of Vitaminaica. Vitamin. What now? All manner of objects related to the witcherly profession. Swords, oh. gear, medallions. Okay. That's the. Can buy stuff. Mind if I ask how the Countess became interested in us, humble monster slayers? Humble? I've some pleasant associations, dating from my oh-so-distant youth. Didn't you see such things, Countess? You look right fetching to me. That's very kind, Master Vivaldi. But apart from my Vedomaniaca, I also own a number of mirrors. Your most prized piece. What would it be? An armor element. An antique. School of the Wolf. From 1234. Classic. Is it up for sale? I fear not. It's a memento. One of great sentimental value. But perhaps the Countess has got other Witcher curios she's willing to part with. Or acquire. 
Uh, perhaps she could trade. I'd charge five percent. A modest. Uh... <laughs> why is this guy part of the transaction? Uh, wh wh why are you part of this? The uh, maid sure? never seen anyone so good at laying their mitts on coin that clinked within earshot. But what the hell? See if we can't make a deal. What does she have? <gasps> oh, never mind. I was like, is it going to be Grandmaster? The Viper. Uh, Why well, is this super cheap? Uh, is it? Uh, I don't know if it's. Uh, it doesn't tell me if it's light armor. Yeah. In any case, we are freaking buying it. I mean, Viper armor? Hell yeah. I can sell stuff to her too. I'm not going to. Nice. Does the Countess have her eye on anything particular today? No, but Horst Borsodi insisted he would put up something that would be of interest. Did he happen to say what it was? No. Oh, you know what he's like. A walking enigma. On another topic. Master Geralt, I was wondering if you'd be willing to help a lady in need. Depends on the nature of the need. Oh, it's quite the trifle. I stepped out onto the balcony a moment ago. I dropped an earring while there. I couldn't find it. It must have fallen through the floorboards. Perhaps you, with your cat eyes. Uh, that's something I want to bother with. Well, we did buy stuff from her, so sure. I'll look Not for a it. problem. I'll go right away. I shall too nice. be much obliged. See you in a minute, Vimy. I also want to see that, uh... You can't do that now, god damn it. Never mind then. <laughs> I wanted to see the armor, but apparently I'm not allowed to. Oh, there it is. Hmm, some spilled wine. Nothing else. Hmm. There's no earring out here, is there? No. What does she want? None. Maybe the Countess would care to explain what this is about, all jokes aside. Forgive me. I... God, this is so embarrassing. Do... Do you know Vesemir? He was a tin shorter than you, wore a mustache. Yes, do I, I do. Know him? Man taught me everything I know. What? How is he, if you don't mind my asking? He's dead, isn't he? I think so. Don't mind at all. I remember. I barely I remember anything. I mind knowing how you knew each other. Oh, I've yeah, I think no it died. One. Not ever. I'm pretty sure he died. But I suppose I owe you an explanation. It was the winter of 1234. A beast prowled the streets of Oxenford. A fledder, I believe. A contract Ooh. was issued, a notice posted, and a witcher appeared. Vesemir, of the school of the wolf. He came through our estate, tracking the beast. Our eyes met, something sparked. I wrote him a message, asked my governess to deliver it. He visited, <laughs> under the cover of night, night after night. On one such occasion, my father heard something. Vesemir had to flee. So quickly, he left behind his gambeson. Ah, the first piece. The start of your collection. Yes. Oh, I see. But also the end of our love. Father had an arrest warrant issued, then quickly married me off. I was fortunate. My husband died young, leaving me a sizable fortune. And thus, I have lived on memories. Afraid I have bad news. Oh? Please tell me. Did he at least die like a witcher? Yes. No. He died like a hero. Good reply <laughs> here. That? I thank you for tolerating a decrepit madwoman so elegantly. Please don't say that. I am old and I am wealthy. I may say what I please. Hmm. And now, 
be so kind and leave me to my thoughts. I wanted to change my uh my attire my uh how I look like but uh Auction admit uh, we will this friend sit down when you're ready to take take part in the auction. Ah oh. Well no we're gonna meet uh Vivaldi's friend first obviously. Hilbert, that may be the one that plays Gwent. Hellbert! It's been years. Allow me to introduce you. Geralt of Rivia. Enchanted. Pleasure's all mine. How's it? Got your eye on any sparkly bits today? Not really. I buy what strikes me fancy. I need something right sumptuous for me walls just now. Nilfgaard. I get it right? Excuse me? Your Gwent deck. It's Nilfgaard, innit? Yeah, it's a Gwent guy. I admit it. I'm not... No, it's not Nilfgaard. I prefer the Northern Realms. Not a bad deck, Nilfgaard. But I'll take the Northern Realms over it any day. Ah, understood. A patriot. You ought to know, <laughs> Helbert. Geralt here's a positively superb player. Superb. I lo I lost. We've got a uh... minute before the auction starts, so nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Maybe around. The, yeah, why not? I'm I'm done for it. It's gonna it's gonna beat me. Like the other one in the other DLC beat me as well. So, ooh, we can bet. Well, you know what. I need to go in. It's not whether you win or lose. Sure, I'm game. Brilliant. It's not. I'll lay my cards out. Naturally. Uh, Geralt, might you have a wee word? Is he a what cheater? Well, mate, since I brought you together, I do believe I'm owed a <laughs> If there are any, 10%. I find this for your sorts, okay? <laughs> Pretty clear now why you wanted us to meet. One cardinal bit I've learnt in my tree, friend. Coin this guy. So, what would be? <laughs> wow. Sure. Whatever. I don't care. Well, you did help with the guards at the door. He did. He did. He did. And I, I'm gonna lose, so. Don't no. It, Vimy. There we go. All right. Game on. I don't know what would happen if I said no, but nah, it's fine. He helped me, even though I don't. I don't think it's very fair. All right, let's see if we can. Uh, is there stuff that I want to change? No, I don't think so. I don't know what he's gonna use. So, uh, he's using Nilfgaardian. All right. Ooh, double. Uh, double decoy. Do I need a double decoy? I'm gonna remove one and I only keep one. No, I'm not uh, forfeiting. Okay. Think so. Oh, yeah. I'm not. I don't play much against uh, against those guys, so we'll see. Come on, give me another spy. No spy. Oh, we got this one though. Ah, oh, he got a decoy. It's okay. It's fine because I can decoy it as well. I'm gonna start with uh, two. We have double of uh, so uh, yeah. Could go double with that actually. He's not gonna use it yet. Uh, uh, if I use those two here, that'd be pretty good. But this guy usually have uh, really good stuff against the uh, melee unit, so maybe not. Wow. Could go eight here and depending on what he plays I might decoy it. A two wow. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna decoy this. Ah oh, but 
He has six cards left. He did use a bunch here. I can't get 13. I mean, I can get 15 if I use Geralt. I feel like it's better than I don't, uh, that I don't push it here. Mm. Ah, he's using this now. Damn, and I can't decoy it. And he's... Damn. Oh, I messed it up, guys. I messed it up. He had, like, two... Free decoy. No, two decoy. Hmm. My opponent passed. You know what I can do? I can call this one. Which is gonna bring this one back. And give me two cards. And I can pass. Oh, wait. I can put this uh, mysterious self. Boom. And get two more cards. Oh, that was there. Uh, that was, and I can decoy this and get it back and pass. I he won. I'm so stupid. I didn't. I fucked up. I am such a freaking idiot. That's a rematch. Apologies, mate, but I only ever play any bloke once. Var file, as them pointy ears say. Oh, hard luck, Geralt. Your cards, though. You find them in the crapper. Didn't line up, did they? Do I want to reload and uh, try to win? I'm, I'm gonna reload and uh, try to win. Uh, I messed up. Well, I know I missed a rare card in the previous one, uh, but the, like here it's me that like I I shouldn't have used the decoy. I had, like I had a perfect thing that was going so well. Uh, it just I I did uh, I I messed I messed up. Okay. But I know I missed a rare card in the previous um uh, previous one already. Let's try again. No, I don't want to loot. Hellbat! Enchanted. Pleasures up. Not real. Nilfka. Excuse me? Your Gwen. Not a bad day. Ah. Your turn. Hmm. Let's go back to 250. Brilliant. Natural. Yeah, the other one, I don't know if I could have won. I probably would have. Well, I don't know. Don't push. Alright, let's try. Okay, okay. Let's not mess it up this time. Uh, ooh, okay, we have one. I know. It, damn it. Uh, double uh, Commander's Horn. I don't know about it. I don't know about the Torrent or Shrine as well. Very pretty good. What do I get? A decoy. Okay, not bad, not bad. I'm not gonna restart after this one though. If I lose, I lose. He uses Dandelion right from the beginning. Oh okay. yeah. Probably going to decoy here. Yeah. That's okay. Let's see if he decoys this one as well. Oh nice. Uh. I can decoy it. Boom. Which I'm pretty happy with this. He passed. Uh, okay. This is good here. He has 10. I have 0. Can I... Uh... Mm. I could probably do this double thing here and win. Because that would put 8-8. Eight, eight. So I want to use both of those one are really powerful though. I could use this one, but it's only give me I think I only have two in my deck. So it's only gonna give me eight. Oops, don't So I guess that that would use two cards. Which would be alright, I guess. 
Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. So eight. And I guess six, yeah. There we go. And pass. What I could have done, I could have done this one, but I think this one would be used, uh, would be much more useful. Okay. Being careful this time. I'm so stupid. He has 10 cards, I have 12. Uh, I might let him uh, win this uh, this round. We'll see. I'm not gonna use this one yet. A scorch. Okay. That's okay actually that he uses scorch now. So otherwise, if I would have used it and used Scotch, it would have given like both of my, uh, both of mine, yeah. Fine. So I'm wasting some of his cards. I can do a uh, trace as well. Let's see if we can win. I don't want to use oh. What is this? Oh, this is Gonte Odim. Oh. Okay. 23. Not bad. Ooh. If he has a Scorch, that'd be a bit annoying. Clear weather. Okay. Uh, I can bring back uh, if I want to here. Yeah. I'm gonna try to win here. Yeah. So I'm gonna push everything I have. Ooh, Lefo. Leto, Lefo, I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna push everything I have here. Yeah. Okay, we're winning. Yes, three counts left, I have four. Ooh. I have a, a really good one. This one is not gonna be used. Let's do this. And we're gonna bring back. Ooh. It's in your deck. So it's not in this cemetery, so. We're gonna put Vesemir. And the reason for it is because I'm gonna use this on this uh, row. I think, yeah. Mm. Okay, good. Uh, that's the card I was uh, I was scared of here. Yeah. That's why I didn't want to use my uh, my double card uh, yet because Scorch close combat is uh, yeah pretty powerful. Uh, I'm gonna do this. No. Technically this one would be better when I'll use this one, but if he kills one, no, I'll go with this. Yeah, no, this is much better, never mind. He has one count left still, and he passed. That was his last count, so I won. Whew. Eighty-four. Okay, that was close. I don't buy it. I got that card, to uh, Odim. Oh, I'd be careful with wow. Ab Hilbert. Afore Geralt takes a mind to demanding satisfaction. <laughs> you give it to him, you damn midget. You bearded pinch fist. Oh, ho, ho, ho. interest will be a right bit higher when that bugger next comes round asking for a loan. Nice. We we won fair, right? Not like we had to reload or anything. Let's do a quick save. Ah! Why are you punching? I don't know you, and Your I don't gray wish to. Really does suit you. Oh wait, Is this guy that I have to talk to, Yaromir. 
Yaramir. Uh, might we trouble you a wee spell? Mm hmm. Greetings, Vivaldi. Who's this? Geralt of Rivia, Witcher. I thought you might have a blather with us. I put the paintings on the block today. Hm? Ah, sniffing for a quick turnaround as usual, are we? Pot calling the kettle black, I'd say. Do a lively trade in canvases yourself, my friend. True. Yet first they delight my eyes, whereas you treat them as mere promissory notes. The only arts that interest you are those culinary. What about you, Witcher? Do you know anything about paintings? Hmm. Apparently, I can say a bit. Not a bit, and I don't much care to learn. Let's go a bit. Realize this might be hard to believe, given my crude-looking mug. But yeah, I know a thing or two. Truly? We ought to see what. Do you know our friend Vivaldi is in possession of five canvases by Van der Nobe? Yet he cannot distinguish them from landscapes at five crowns apiece. I shan't <laughs> pretend it's otherwise. Yet for you, my dear connoisseur Witcher, that should present not the slightest problem. So do tell which of these is the handiwork of Edward Van der Nobe, the master from Maribor. Wow. Uh I have not a clue. Indicate the pastoral, the view of Novigrad, the portrait of the merchant, the still life, or the battle scene. Is it I d I don't know anything about uh Edouard van der Noob. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I guess there is still the option, no ID. It's either I take a chance and go with one of the five options, which is like... I guess I'll have a chance to have like one in the... I, I think I'll go with no ID. I'm not gonna take my chance here. Yeah. I'll be honest. Want a hint? Yeah, sure, uh, Cryphon. Cause I, I don't know. I'd say... Uh... Maybe the view of Novigrad? I don't know. Because it did say that uh, he was making like uh, that this guy had like five paintings of him and. Oh no, 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 never mind. He was still talking about those ones. So I don't know. No, I, I, don't, I have no idea. He likes people. Screw the hint. <laughs> also, it, I guess there's a merchant then. Right, well, could be the battle scene, could it not? What is the uh, what is still life? Nah, it's gonna be the merchant. How do you know that though? The food is still life. Oh, okay. <sighs> Really? Merchant with the pearl, no two ways about it. My, my. Who would have thought? Played the game like three times, Not yeah, okay. A word in private. Yeah. Forgive me my impertinence. At first, I thought you were an ignoramus. Vivaldi's equal. I'm glad I didn't go with no idea. Thank you, uh, Cryphon. I tell you a secret. A Van Roe is due to appear on the block. The painter's unknown largely, but has a fierce admirer in Marcus Hodgson, a bookseller, as he shop in Novigrad's main square. I wager you'll sell him the canvas at a tidy profit. Thanks. Oh, think nothing of it. Now, please excuse me. My friends back in. So, what did he tell you? Oh. Oh. I've been like super nice with him here. It's possible that uh, he's screwing with me though.
you know, no, no, no. Yeah, but if I say that, it's possible that this guy will want to get it. And maybe he said it for me to say to him, I'm reading way, way, way too much into it, aren't I? <laughs> I just go with this. Apparently this bookseller in Novigrad's willing to pay top coin for his work. Oh, who'd have thunk? All right, let's go. Ink spot upon ink spot. She a number of them's doing my heed in. I'm, I'm too honest. Huh. Esteemed ladies, honorable gentlemen, the auction will begin shortly. Take your places, please. Ah, at long last. Come with me to the fore. I won't see much elseways. I wanted to be able to check the uh, character on uh, a glossary thing, but apparently not. And I wanted to listen your mom about the noob you. guy. How's this auction going to work? They'll bring out three lots to start with. Once they've sold, or not, they'll be an intermission. Horst Basodi will probably appear then. That's when I'll introduce you. Count All right. In the meantime, have you got a budget? You prepared to beg? If you can spot me a couple on there. No, I'll wait in the back. Yeah, let's go with course I will. Of course I will. Went to the trouble to sneak me in here. I'd be an ass not to take a stab. Ha! I knew the bug would get you. <laughs> I, I mean, I have some money, so. Esteemed ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. I hereby open the auction. Ladies and gentlemen, lot number one is a brass figurine from the collection of the infamous Count Romilly. Rumor has it the figure harbors a treasure inside. A rumor one may prove or disprove solely by destroying the beautiful bauble itself. Starting price? Quite the bargain at 50 crowns. Any advance? With Master Hilbert at 100. To Countess Mignol, now at 150. Do I hear 200? Might I have an advance? The white-haired gentleman enters a bid of 200. Do we have 250? 200 once, twice, thrice. Splendid Countess Mignot bids 250. Do I hear 300? Damn it. Give it to me. I'm going to break it and get the treasure. Oh my, this is lively. <laughs> going once, going twice. Do we have 350? I'm taking it. Thank you. And sold to the white-haired fellow. Lot number one, the mysterious brass figurine. Proceeding now to lot number two. It's completely useless, isn't it? By the young Nova <laughs> oh, that's the one I need. Starry night over the Pontar. Charming. Oh, that looks pretty good. A bargain at 20 crowns. Ladies and gentlemen, 20 crowns. It's practically naught. Yeah, true. All right, I'll bid. 20. Oh, with a bidder. Cat-eyed, no less. At 20. Do I hear 30? Forgive me, Geralt. But business is business. I shouldn't have tell you. Do I see wow. You're, you're. Going twice? Yeah, I'm going to bid. Aha! The white haired gentleman bids 40. Who will bid more? 40 once? 40 twice? Vivaldi the bank is not about to give up easily. 50! Any advance on 50? <laughs> 50 going once? Going twice? Last chance, ladies and gentlemen. I, I, I want to. Thank you. Oh, we've a right bidding war here. 60? The excitement! An advance on 60! Have the money, as so. well. 60 going once, 60 I'm taking everything. Twice. Oh, all yours, Geralt. Thank Sold you. Sold Van Rose Starry Night over the Pontar to the gentleman with the cat eyes. That looks nice. Lot number three, ladies and gentlemen. A true rarity, scarce as hen's teeth. Spectrum. What's this? A frame of gold. Mountain crystal lenses polished by the tiny dexterous hands of the gnome masters. Once the property of the famed hired assassin known as the Professor. Starting price of 200 crowns. 200? Went Maestro Hilbert offers an advance of 50. Do I have three? My, haven't we live enough? Who's the Professor? From Yaramir Ivanovich Zaitsev. Going once, twice. I, I want it. In I want everything. Gentlemen, now good folk at 350 crowns. No People are gonna hate me. <laughs> They're gonna hate me. I'm just taking everything. Exceedingly glad they'll be useful. They serve you well. 
Oh, the excitement. I got an achievement. Three lots behind us. <laughs> Amenities abound. Please partake. We'll resume shortly. Uh, thanks. I have to check what I, what I bought. Oh. Oh, fish. Geralt. Look, horse Basudi. Come on, pour some other cocksuckers stealing. Just, well, don't expect a warm welcome. All oh, right, I want his house. I, I kind of forgot that the entire point I'm here. Greetings. Oh, no, I want the house of someone else. I don't know. Friend and associate, Geralt of Rivia. Who comes uninvited? Uh, forgot my manners. That may be so, but you gain, but you gain by my presence. You know what? Let's go with this. But you've gained by my presence. Dropped a hefty pile of crowns here. I'm not like Vivaldi. Profit alone only goes so far for me. Okay. I seek more. The auction house is primarily a meeting place for the local elite. I needn't tell you. An itinerant mutant doesn't quite fit in. <laughs> Got the distinct impression the two of you started off on the wrong foot. Perhaps we should raise a toast to. What's one like you want from one like me? Oh, yes, this is. Yeah, need to find Maximilian Boro Borso at his house. Okay. This isn't working for me. Unless a Borso I could talk to. This guy isn't very nice, but. It's a, it doesn't look like it's a decisive uh, like option so I, I'll go with it even though it feels a bit messy. Silly's auction house. I'm assuming the name's no coincidence. Got a relative I could talk to? Someone how do I say this? A smidgen less irritating <coughs> name's a historical legacy, Geralt. Auction house was founded by two brothers, Horst's father and an uncle. In this generation I and only I am it. So get to the point now. All right. Right. Let's dispense with the niceties. Maximilian Borsodi's house. Gotta lay my hands on it. Whatever it. What? Where did you learn of it? Gentlemen, no reason to lose our composure. Raise our voices. <laughs> I ask you, where did you learn of it? Whoa! Come on now. Where? Whoa. Do I go with the truce? I mean, this guy doesn't really like me. Does it really matter? I mean, it does matter. No, I want Geralt to be fairly honest. From Allgeard von Everek, name mean anything to you? It does. Guards, escort the Witcher out. And he's not to enter, not alone, not hand in hand with Hierarch Hamelfart. Honestly, well, I... he asked a question. It was a simple inquiry. One more word, yeah. and I shall move my accounts to the competition. Sorry, mate, but... Thank you, Vivaldi. Trouble the guards, Horst. I'll go willingly. I don't recall giving you a choice in the matter. Kick his swiving mutated ass out. Well, that did not go too well. We got some new stuff, though. Hell yeah, a painting? That I can sell for like more money, hopefully. Well, wow, you didn't have to kick me like this. Law says we're to return them. Law Thank don't you. say when though. So we'll do it, I. Just after we beat the singing shite out of the honorable gentleman. Are you serious? Gathering place for the elite, truly. Yep. Come on, lads. Let's loosen our muscles a bit. Like, do you not know who I am? Damn it. Oh, come on. Oh shit, I messed up. <sighs> Your swords, master. Just need you to see. <laughs> That's a... Fuck you. Mm. Depositor refused to confirm. Damn it, I messed up. Signed Sergeant Figner. A pleasant day to you. It was my first combat today, okay? And also like one punch. Uh, they keep like 
Two versus me, that was that wasn't fair. I should have won though. I'm not gonna reload though. It's okay. There's many against one, even a witch is dumb. No. Not in the mood for your peasant wisdom. Who the hell are you? Yep. If all goes well, dare say I'm your partner. Don't need any partners. Oh, I don't know about that. No chance you'll lay your hands on Max Bosodi's house alone. I'd how would you know I'm looking for the house and you think you can help me? Is that it? Let's go with the first one. How do you know I was looking for the house? I was of the option. Disguised, of course. That argument on the topic was hard to miss. Get to the point, if you can. To get this house, you need to get into the vault. And there's no way Horst will let you in there out of the kindness of his heart. A heist? Don't like that idea one bit. Got any others? Find the herbalist lives near Oxenfurt. Ask for some yarrow extract. He'll know why you've come. If this is a trap of some sort. We're seeing you. I hope. Who the heck is this guy? Any more cutting? No. Quest updated. Character entry added a stranger. Character entry added host Bossodi. Received some experience point barely any. An avid collector on your quest. Anything else? No. Like that we uh that I lost but uh add the new uh, quest, yeah. Tell the venerable painting to the Novigrad book merchant. Oh, this is a secondary quest, yeah. Well, we can go uh, sell the uh, quest. What I'd like to check as well is the new stuff we got. Which was... There it is. A professor spectacles. Spectacles ones belonging to the professor, an assassin for hire. Look at the... Uh, a girl looks uh, freaking amazing with those. <laughs> don't know anything about the professor though. Wait! Oh, they don't take a slot uh, or anything. Wait, where? Do oh, they are here at the, at the bottom. Is it the same? Oh, it's the same thing for the uh, for the heels. Uh, so I can have the heels uh, all the time now. Well, maybe not. I don't think I should keep the... Uh... No, I, sh I shouldn't keep them. <laughs> That's nice though. Uh, what else did I get? I got the painting and I got one more thing. <gasps> A statue uh, thing. Where is it? Can I break it or...? That's not gonna be here. It's gonna be here, most likely. I have so much stuff in my inventory, it's a bit hard to... Uh, to see anything. There is a painting here. Is it a uh, bull figurine? Or? I like how items needed to complete the quest. Why aren't you in a freaking quest item then? <laughs> this is. <laughs> uh, I don't know where I don't know where it is. Not an armor or anything like it. So no. I mean, it it must be here. I just can't seem to see it. Bone. Broken. Incense. Counts. Is it this one? The uh, figure in there? I don't think so. Ooh, I can. It only books after here? Yeah. 
I don't know, we bought something. I got an achievement probably for buying everything, so that's okay to me. Where there is a guy we need to... It was a bird. Oh, right. Let's see. Oh, this, yeah, yeah, this is this one. Item needed to complete a quest. So it is a... Uh, it will be used for something at some time. At some, uh, at some point then. It seems, it looks like a bird, yeah. I think it's, it's, it's this one, yeah. yeah. What? In any case, for now we need to go and sell our... Uh, our new painting that we bought. Bought. There we go. Uh... I could inform uh, all gear that the task has been completed. Yeah, let me do that since it's right there. It's probably gonna tell me that I have the other one to do now. Let's get this too. Where is he? Harry just got a turn and mix from time to time. I don't save my game right now. I don't know. Okay. What are they doing? Play. Overgrown wains, you see. Have you any children, Geralt? None. Oh, yes. Forgot witches is sterile. Well, don't just stare at me. Tell me what brings you. Oh, I can play Gwent with him. That's a uh, we'll uh, we'll play Gwent. Chosen some interesting specimens. Interested? How so? Common carouses and roughnecks. Every last one. Where did you dig them up? Some have been with me ages. Others are gathered on the road, and a few found me themselves. They're company for drink and sport, at least. And ever since I began travelling with them. My old enemies have sat quiet as moles. First time I've seen a saber like that. What's its origin? A fear. It was a gift. Any soft armed craven can hang a blade from his belt, prance about feigning danger. But my saber's a promise. If I reach for it, heads will roll. The mere sight of it quells the urge to duel. In Shaver's eager to face Olkir von Everick, the infamous outlaw. My medallion seems to think it's magic. <laughs> it thinks, eh? And I think you've never seen a better weapon. Oh, my weapon is probably better than yours. Keep wondering how you turned the Ophiri into a beast. The more I think about it, the more I'm sure it was no run-of-the-mill curse. This professional curiosity, or nosiness, as common as the clan. Desire to improve. Information could prove useful down the line. In the future, you under the delusion you'll complete your tasks, live happily ever after. Remains to be seen. So for now, admit it. A mage helped you, right? I'll give you a hint. You're not the only one to fulfill wishes around here. Oh, Dim transformed the Ophiri? It was your wish? Nay. It was my doing alone. But you're right. It was no ordinary curse. Though I'll say no more. A curse I uttered in a moment of rage. With no thought to it actually take it hold. Uh, I think it's Deathmatch, uh, and I'll check it out in a second. Tell me, how'd you meet the Ophiri you turned into a beast? Aren't you a nosy one? What's it matter? You like to talk about yourself. That I cannot deny. Ophiri was a dofa on a voyage through lands unknown. To learn of their cultures and customs. He fell for her lass. As it happened, this woman was already important to me. But at the time, I was now compared to a noble from a foreign land. So her parents promised her hand to the Afiri, though she loved me. If you'd only seen his feeble attempts at charm. When she asked why he travelled disguised as a common merchant, he said he was like the frog from the fairy tale. One kiss from her, and he turned into a prince. Wanted to be a frog. Became a frog. This guy is interesting. 
Let's play Gwent with him. You ever play Gwent? An immortal demands you fulfill three wishes, and you've the gall to propose a round of Gwent. <laughs> yeah. Lose. No problem. I'll find someone else. Believe that's the worst wind-up I've ever heard. Play out your cards. Love <laughs> how oh, everyone plays Gwent in this game. Uh, can I use the new one I got? I don't know. Yes, I can use Gonto or Dim. Um, do I want to though? It will uh, Gonto or Dim Darkness. Yeah, it will bring out those two. Hmm. Yeah. Might be a bit too many cards in my deck. But. Um, uh, there is also, uh, I also have a mod that, that technically kind of increases the difficulty as I cannot use uh, uh, food and uh, oils and stuff like that during combat. Oh, he's using monsters, alright. Uh, double scorch I don't think is going to be super important. I finished the base game already, yeah, uh, and... Oh, where to go? I'm gonna remove a scorch. Why is this one eight? I don't know. Shouldn't be. Why is it eight? Oh, is it? Wait, is it one of his uh, power? Double the strength of all spy cards. Wow! All right. This is uh, giving him a eight. Is pretty, uh, pretty big. Oh well. Might have a decoy. Oh, I have another decoy. That kind of sucks. I'm gonna leave it. I'm gonna let him win that first uh, round, I guess. Yeah. He used a lot of cards. I think two decoy kind of sucks there. I could try to uh hmm. I'm gonna remove a decoy so I'm gonna make him to like use more cards here. He's probably gonna pass. No. Interesting. That's good for me here. I'm gonna do I'm just gonna use decoy this. There we go. He's still not passing, interesting. I don't know if I'll be able to uh, get the, the quest to get all the cards. I didn't fail, uh, I didn't fail it yet, so we'll see. I'm gonna do the same thing here, because I don't think he has another, uh, another spy. Ooh, I use this one too, hell yeah. I don't know why he's not passing. He, he almost has no cards left. There we go, he finally passed. Oh uh, well. I'm not gonna... The opponent has passed, yeah. Let's use uh... Oh, I forgot uh... Let's use this. I, I didn't say this one. <laughs> Let's just use like a stick. Hmm. Well, no, uh, the, uh, I'm pretty sure Gwen's free to play uh, uh, Cryphon. So you can just play Gwen if you wanted to. Yeah, I see. Oh, he probably meant from Breaker. Uh. Oh, he has a lesson. Nice. There is a. St there has been a standalone game for a long time, Cryphon, and I'm pretty sure it's free to play. Called Gwent, which I played even before knowing that it was something in Witcher 3. Like, I had no idea. Mm. 
is the scotch. Toad. Yeah. Open and past. I can use a scotch. I won't anyway. I wonder if I, I, I probably missed uh, like beating someone at Gwenzen because I'm guessing it's part of the base game and I'm doing DLC right now. Shite. Not much I detest more than losing. Well, my congratulations. This card's yours. Thanks. Thank you. What did I get? Oh, I got the toad. Uh, nice. Vladimir sends his love. You spoke to him. Impossible. Did more than that. Fulfilled your wish. And talked to him extensively. Curious what he had to say? <coughs> Fulfilled your wish. Two more to go. Your dead brother had himself one more day like those of old. Very easy to say. But have you got any proof? I do. Vladimir's hand is unmistakable. You've done well, Witcher. Is that all? Or have you something else? Gonna work on getting you Bersodi's house next. Best of luck. Enjoy. Alright. Let me wait for a second here. First updated. Deadman's party. Watch a pickle. And let me see options. Gameplay. Difficulty level death march. Yep. Death march is the uh hardest one. I do not have enemy upscaling on though. And like I said, I do have mods that technically kind of make the game a bit harder. As I cannot use food or oils uh, during combat. Uh, let me check the quest, because uh, I still have the quest, collect them all, but I don't think there is a... Uh... Yeah, there is no... Uh... There is no tracker. Yeah, you can't track it. Does it? So I, I don't know. I must have uh, missed uh, something. Alright, we are gonna go and sell the Venero painting. Apparently it's raining. Like the base game in Deathmatch was fairly easy, but the DLC uh, definitely uh, harder. I'm really liking. By that, it's been a while since I've played as well, so I'm having a bit of uh, ice paint. Oh, yeah, I can. You're choked to death on three pounds of steam. You can't spread disease. Defeat is a matter. You played just the story last time. Nice. I really enjoyed the uh, story of Witch of Red by far. It, it's a great one. I should read the books. Using a big blue QT emote, yeah. Oh wait, is there a 
Is it, wait, there is a difficulty that just uh, story? Wow, okay. I didn't know. My game crashed. <laughs> I tried to change the difficulty and it crashed. <laughs> God damn it. Give me a second. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's your own damn fault, Hunt here. You, you made my game crash. How could you? <sighs> Sorry, yeah. So yeah, the achievement that I got was Sopa Shopaholic. Buy all the items part on the block at the Bosodis auction house. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Why would you play with just the story? Like, the game is... It's a game isn't hard at all. I see you get and before, the game doesn't freaking capture anymore. Which could be possible. Not tell me. It's not gonna capture either. I swear, man. Well, maybe not this much. I didn't start with this much, actually, uh, Hunch. <laughs> I started with the one before that. And... I still find it a bit too easy, so I went with this much. But I'm having some trouble with this much, like, for the DLC here. <laughs> now that's broke, I know, right? God damn it. Game isn't even launching anymore. <laughs> God damn it. Just be I didn't know there was a uh, difficulty, just the story. Uh, did you finish Witcher 2 then, uh, Hunch? Ultimate difficulty. Man, I'm I'm gonna have to like force uh force close Witcher 3 here, yeah. It's it's not even launching anymore. What the heck? What is happening? I broke my game. Let's try again. I swear, man. Can you, can you, can you, can you launch? The game is actually not launching anymore. Come on, man. Well, this isn't good. <laughs> All right, we're good. We're fine. Where is my, uh... <gasps> Where is my checkpoint? Wow, my checkpoint is super far away. I think it's even before uh, I got the fight with the other guys here. <laughs> oh no 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 no! It's uh, it's after uh, it's after me talking to uh, old grade, I guess. Yeah, yeah, must be. Hey Mio, how are you doing today? Yeah, it's after me talking with uh The thinking customer will see right away I've got the best deals this side of the Ponta. Empty herring barrel. Stinks of fish. Good food. Mm. Why is it like this? Alright. Let's get the hell out. Thank you, Mio. I didn't pause it, yeah. <laughs> uh. Alright. Let's go. Uh. You'll choke to death on three pounds of steam. Let's actually use a roach here. Well, let me be sure that it didn't save my uh, difficulty. Okay, 
I'm on death march. I am not ever touching this goddamn uh, slider anymore. Uh, we're good. We're good. Also, uh, you are. I think I said your name right. Should uh, I mean? Now, like it's Black Friday right now, so I'll probably deal with some graphics cards if uh, if you want to upgrade your PC uh, and see if you can get one for cheap that runs uh, Witcher Three. To be fair. Witcher 3 doesn't require like a really good uh, graphics card to get uh, to run, I don't think so. I think it runs on uh, a lot of uh, PC. Depending if you're okay with playing it at a lower frame rate. It's weekend now? Hell yeah! Watch your step! You're going to a medieval themed market. Wait, is it is this one of those vegan market again? Uh, a vegan thing, uh, Mio? That sounds super cool, though. Damn. You seem to have like lots of uh, lots of uh, interesting uh, stuff going on, uh, like where you live. That's pretty nice. He has drunk every weekend, yeah. <laughs> uh. Run, Roach. Mm. Wow, that's not such a bad life, is it? Got only four games, three games. Oh, you have done. Oh, you mean dying like the hunt, which are two, but my Arkham is on, which are free downloading. Wow, that's a lot of games. I like the slave description. <laughs> uh. Wow, so Mio wants a slave, huh? Alright. <laughs> uh. Scary. Maybe she already has one in our in our basement. Actually, cry from. Are you going to like uh like cosplayer uh, in your like medieval uh, themed uh, market uh, meal? Are, are you going as a peasant? <laughs> as a farmer? I'm joking. Let's get out. Australian seems to have a habit with keeping people in their basement. Right! You were like making fun of it uh, the other day. Wait, what? Are you talking to me? Hey, you! Yes, you! You got water on the brain! <coughs> what the hell is wrong with you? I could punch, punch you. No cosplay today? Ah. Oh. Let's see if I can uh, repair my gear, maybe. I don't know if I need to, but might as well. Hey, need something sharp. 
I'd like you to. <laughs> right there, I quit. Yeah. So long. <laughs> wow, what are you insinuating, uh, me? Wow. Ah, oh my God. By order of the hierarch. Where am I going? Right there. Hello. Ah, you're back. Got a painting I'm looking to sell. Good. I should have. Uh, said. But why come me about it? Cause it's a Van Rowe. Heard you might. A Van Rowe? I'll take it. Now where's me purse? I haven't much just now. But I'll add a bit of loot. Another witch I left it as collateral. What was his name? Guyatine? That's so. Interesting. Thanks. You sued uh, a medieval dress, Mio. Well, I didn't see that uh, until now. That's amazing. Uh, damn. Quest updated. Quest completed. Is there a fire going? Don't worry, though. I don't want them go powers either. What was a Witcher item? I don't know. I'm gonna check right now. Oh, I got a trophy. What is this thing? Uh, strap trophies to a saddle. Five percent bonus gold. What do I have right now? Find additional herbs. <laughs> I don't really care about that. I don't care about anything really. Let's get this one. So he didn't give me money then, he gave me the uh, trophy. Can't even check the uh, request now. Oh. So many freaking quests. No, I did collect there. Also threw in a rare Witcher trophy. So no, he gave me money as well, I don't know how much. I actually don't have that much money anymore. I did use a lot uh, in the, what is it called? Uh, yeah, we're going there. During the, uh, the auction house. Hmm, alright, let's go. <laughs> Maybe some the bestiality will be accepted too socially. <laughs> what the heck? Uh, I learned how to sue in university. Wow! Damn, that's crazy. That's awesome though. Like the So will they sell booze in your, uh, in your like medieval uh, marketing? They should, right? <laughs> I mean, I'm sure that's the only reason you're going there. So, <laughs> for sure they will. <laughs> Is it like also like themed uh, from like old times as well? Uh? Oh, I just. Oh, is it just recent stuff? Not that I know anything about that kind of stuff anyway. Yeah, only a reason. Wow. That sounds great though. <laughs> wow.
Why did I? Why am I trying to follow a stupid GPS? Or the line? I I forgot I can I can drum. Ooh. Oh, I don't care what here. Oh, you. I remember the terrible list, I think. This is the one I saw not long ago. Come on now. Oh, please save before. Wow. Okay, Fallen Knight. Damn it. Oh, crap. Ooh, I'm, uh, I'm taking tons of damage here. Oh, yeah, let's be a bit careful, shall we? You know, this is not being careful. Ah, uh, let's, 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 didn't happen, it's been a while since I've played, okay? The merchants are dressed up, uh, when they sell, we get food from the Middle Ages, or they sell swords and jewelry and everything you can think of. Oh my god. Mia's gonna, Mia's gonna buy a sword. She, she's gonna... Oh, come on! I'm back. I should have saved. I mean, I was going to save, but I couldn't save because of uh, being on the... Damn it. Being on the... She's gonna play a... She's gonna buy a spear. Love <laughs> a freaking um, more to IRL. And be like, wait, why aren't those people not respawning? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that's so stupid. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Uh, also, I really need to. I was going to save and I, I, I couldn't because I like, enter in combat instantly. But damn it. <laughs> the world re re isn't ready for that. Uh, uh. Hmm. I tried to take some pictures. Oh, that'd be great, uh, Mia. I'd really like to see how it is. Come on. <laughs> the rage quit. Yeah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Yeah, it's not messed up this time. I'm surprised I died that quickly too, wow. Usually I can take like at least like a couple of hits. Well, I did take a couple of hits, but... Yeah. I'm, uh, I'm gonna be a bit more careful. I have my proper uh, equipment, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I didn't check. Uh, I forgot. We got the... Silver stuff. Where is it? No, Viper, not silver. Oh, it's medium. Ah, damn it. I'm gonna wait a bit before I save. Save here at least. Mm. <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> Alright, let's save again. Almost there. Not so fast, Roach. Oh, I have a cutscene now? Okay. I guess I skipped everything uh, be I, because I didn't go through the main entrance. She's. What's the freaking ball here? Wait, oh, come on, man. No, don't attack Roach. Come back here. There we go. Bolt between its ribs. It was being hunted. Something went horribly wrong, though. Yeah? Okay. Save again. Music when. Okay. Let's go. I'm not gonna die this time. Come on, freaking uh. Oh, I know why I took so much damage. The guy was uh. Yep, it's a freaking one shot dude. Oh man. <laughs> yeah. Uh, wait, how the heck did you. Uh, did he uh, one shot me? No, hard doesn't do. Uh, I need to use Axie for shield uh, punch. Not hard isn't, isn't really good. So you're playing freaking just for the story. How would you know anything? I should have used Quenzel. I don't... I need to check... Uh, like, what is the... Uh, no, that's not this. There we go. Nice. Come on, die from the bleeding. Oh yeah, look, Ard. It doesn't do much. I mean, it, you you can go behind him after doing Ard, but this is not particularly good. While Axie, eh? Much better. Much better if you even have the, uh, even Igni. Oh, Igni is not that great though. Never mind. Oh, I can just block too. Oh, I miss. Yeah, that wasn't very good. I feel like Lots to do. I should have been on like freaking uh, death march this entire time. So I don't know. Like all of a sudden, it feels harder. Isn't there like another uh, loot uh, place? Guess not. Alright. What's happening? Huh. That was rather efficient. That all you got to say? I saved your life. Efficient? I died three times. That's not very efficient. We'd have disposed of that rabble easily. We? My, aren't we precise? You know what I mean. Now, are you here to trade or not? Hmm? Yeah, some yellow thingy. Yarrow extract, not yellow. Uh, did you know Roach is just the name he uses for every horse he gets? No, it's not. It's the same horse every time. <laughs> Wouldn't happen to have some yarrow extract. I do. In the back. Follow me, please. This is, uh, this is, okay. I'm a witch, I'll be fine. A bit dark here. I have a, wait, I need a torch. Mm 
And Joel, how are you doing today? You've come. Good. Remains to be seen. Aim to tell me something, I think. So talk. How do I put this? We share a goal. We both need to get into the Borsodi's vault. Both want something that's in there. Oh. Why not pool our strengths? Look at yours. But what exactly Thief. is yours? I have a plan. Spent the last year working on it. On paper. Time to set it in motion. Damn it, yeah. You one I can count on. <laughs> not blue. Guess it's my lightning that's a my lighting, that's a bit weird. <laughs> also, uh, that's not my fault if uh, Twitch doesn't show I'm live. I've been live for like an hour now. Yeah, almost two actually. Mm. Let's see, what does he want? The vault. What's in there for you? Something that was stolen from me. Mm, ought I go to the city watch, tell them a crime's been committed, not organize a heist? I've tried. Repeatedly. I see. Cheated by the system, wronged by the world. Doesn't matter. What did they take? List to take a good while. So I'd rather change the subject. You in or not? Yeah, uh, it's not gonna be very chatty about what you want. Before we go any further, you even know what Max Bersodi's house is? I know it's in the vault. Didn't answer my question. Neither of you. Willing to help with the heist or not? Come on. I don't even know your name. What's that matter? Matters because you're clearly hiding something. Not just from me, either. Wouldn't be sitting in a cellar in this shit hole otherwise. We've all some stain on our conscience. But I've not asked for your hand in marriage. Just for your help in a heist. We break in. Each take what we need, then go our own ways. Try to trick me anyway, anyhow. You won't go anywhere. You know that? Because I'll take your head off right where it meets your neck. I'm Damn. Aware of risks. So now that you've threatened me and all, are you in or are you not? I don't feel like I have a choice. <laughs> you know, I almost uh, joined uh, Discord and Joel because I was like, maybe I, maybe we could continue Stellaris, and I was like, no, I'll play a bit more Witcher and maybe like uh, play Stellaris later. I'm not as tired as I was yesterday, so uh, I ended up not joining Discord. <laughs> I'm not a thief. It's opportunity makes the thief, Witcher. Still not my fault. I speak from experience. <sighs> Talk. Twenty Redanian soldiers guard the auction house, day and night. Patrols walk in circles around it, and here, past this corner, barracks. Brute force is out. Gotta get in quietly. Exactly. Not the simplest thing, though. Main entrance, armored door, windows, dimeridian bars. But not a fortress out there without a weakness. This one's no different. Oh, I could just use art so on the freaking wall and blow up the wall. But no. Inside the house stands a tower from which we can enter the attic. We can't hope to enter the tower from the street on account of the patrols, but... There's a window 60 feet off the ground. No shutters, no bars. We've got to get up there and sneak across to the auction house, then down the stairs to the cellar, crack open or blow off the vault door, and voila. <laughs> Looks bleak to me. Yeah. I go with this. Looks bleak to me. Tower walls smooth as glass. Don't know about you, but I can't scale that and... And I've not asked you to. Let me finish. Well, I thought you were finished. Oh, really? I feel like I'm playing GTA. <laughs> like planning a heist. Why is it my job? Prefer to remain largely out of sight. Mm -hmm. Assumed as much given your hood. Anything else? I. But that's among the details, which you will learn just as soon as you declare. Hmm, so be it. I don't really have a choice. <sighs> don't really have any other options. Exactly. So be it. I'm in. But on one condition, no one dies. That clear? As the great son of Nilfgaard. How about we knock back around? Talk some mutually beneficial relationship. 
Rather get to work. What comes first? First, you have to assemble a crew. Then, there's the Redanian patrols to cull a bit. Too many wandering around. We could get noticed. I like how he says no one dies, even though, like, freaking Gerard's been killing, like, people like crazy. Uh, getting inside, what do we have? What do we have? Opening the boards with our options, playing the patrols. What's that about? It's the getting inside. Break in artists. Tell me about them. Assuming lack of vertigo to be the first requirement. <laughs> Precisely why my favorite Evelyn Gallo. A circus artist known better as the Urban. Just now performing with her troupe somewhere near Oxenfurt. Her specialities, rhythmic gymnastics. Uh, breaking and entering. Not officially, no, but I've compared the route her troops taken with a list of the most audacious thefts in recent years. A perfect match. Highly doubt that's a coincidence. But if she's reluctant, we've another option in Hugo Hoff, alias Beef Patty. A halfling. Think he's fit? Pudgy face doesn't really match my image. Ha <laughs> ha. You'd be surprised. Hugo's notched up more break-ins than you felled monsters. More importantly, two years past, he nicked the gold-plated cock from the roof of the town hall in Novograd. So, the half man. No, I want her. Uh, I don't want him. Word has it, he's holed up in Oxenfurt in a house near the Novograd gate. Be careful. He's modest in size, but apparently wicked dangerous. All right. What about opening right. the vault? Opening the vault. Who do we have? Let's start with the fact that one of them's a dwarf. Cast I'm fine with a dwarf. Native of Mahakam. A specialist in controlled explosions. Folks say he can blow Novograd to the high heavens with but a pinch of saltpeter. Bolt door for him should be a cinch. That sounds good. Was your other one? Casimir apparently hung up his detonator some time ago. He married, sired some littler ones, and settled in the village of Almas. Might play turn us down. Any options? Quinto, the North's most famed safecracker. Arrest warrants out on him in Kedwin, Lyria, Angrin, and Kavir. Sadly, he got nabbed a few days back by one Hans of Sidaris, a prick mercenary. I know the man. Slew an arch griffin for him. Yeah. Mean fiend, pretty much. I remember. That was a while ago. Both, actually. Hmm. So I'd have to rip one from his cozy home, the other from a cozy cage. Need to think about it. I'd probably go as a dwarf. What's this about calling the patrols? Told you, no one dies. Easy. I don't want anyone's death. Just need some folk to be temporarily indisposed. Spit it out. You've got to approach the garrison's cook. Convince him to spite the soldiers' nosh with something to keep some of them bedridden. One in two, let's say. When one to obey his suspicions. Hmm. Know the formula for a potion that might do the trick. There. See? Brew up a bit of that. Hit the town, find the cook, then convince him to do you a favor. I don't know, cast a spell, toss him some coin. You can also use your fists. Alright. Alright, I'm off. Got a bit to do. As do I. Get it all done, and we'll meet back here. What then? Then, we'll bug a horse up, down, and sideways. All together. As much as I agree it has uh, its issues, I still think it's worth watching uh, and what's that? He's still a stranger, I still don't know what his name actually here. Yeah. Got tons of uh Can I even talk to him? Ooh, can I uh Well, I'm gonna loot this place. Thank you.
Alright, let's check the quest that we do have. Ooh, what did I get? Oh damn it, it doesn't show anymore. Uh Oh yeah, the new stuff. Yeah, we have tons of uh yeah. Hmm. Safe cracker, convince Casimir to take part in the robbery. Look to Quinto. Repair the uh go to the house. Convince Evelyn. I want her. Yeah. And which one is the other one I think? I think it was Casimir. Let me just hundred percent be sure that's the one I want. Well, I can't really read it, so never mind. I think it was Casimir. Yeah. This is super freaking dark here. Not even see shit. No, it is. Hmm. Okay. Where is it? Oh, it's not that far away. Eh? It's right there. And see, hopefully we'll be able to convince her. It seems to be pretty good. Let's do a quick save. It's cool. Let's go! Mm. I should be able to convince her, right? Yeah. Save again. Slow now. Then let's return their coin to them. What would we We've spent it all. Every last coin. That's Evelyn, yeah. You could, you know, find more. Watching his money. Solution. That's always your solution. Should have stayed in the forest with my unit. Might at least have died with dignity. What's happening, yeah? The minute we're in trouble, you make me responsible for getting us out. As in Maribor. Remember Maribor? Dove, please don't change the subject. Mind if I do? That depends. Who might you be? Geralt of Rivia. Witcher. You Eveline Gallo? The Ermine? Only to friends. Calm down, hmm. Merrin. No need to puff up. And you? Talk. What do you want? Well, oh. I'd prefer to speak to you. Privately, wanted to ask you to work with me. Let's go with this, yeah. Uh, oh, let's Never go with the first one. I. Everline conceals nothing from me, and... And you were to help set up the benches. Immediately. Yeah. <laughs> but... Get out. Very well, once again, what do you want? Got a job for you. Truly? Of what nature? Hmm. Anonymous performance. No audience. At a certain auction house. Pays as much as you can carry. Hmm. You've none of a Fink's features. But you see, I've a problem. All the hills, what is it? All right, out with it. What's this problem? See, we were to do a show. The tickets have all sold. Alas, our friend and colleague, Hawkeye Van, well, he's gone blind. Drank some hooch from a questionable source. A sad story, but not the point. The crowd awaits, so either we find a replacement for him, or we shall have to return the coin. All good and fine, but we're not spent it already. Oh, ah, I think I know where this is going. And I should get straight to the point. Stand in for Van? 
and I shall help you. What do I have to do? Jump through some flaming hoops? No. Shoot your crossbow, hit a target. Hmm. That, that sounds a okay. Bad shot with my crossbow. Why not? I'm in. Splendid. So, shall we begin? Folk have grown nervous. What? Mean now? No rehearsals? What's that to rehearse? You're to shoot and hit a target. Okay. Right. But I guess if I fail. You or die. Let's begin. That I like. A man who boldly Let's see if I can, uh... damn the risks. Come! <laughs> Let's see if I can uh, do it here. Yeah. now, good folk, the highlight of our program. Standing before you, Geralt of Rivia, victor of markmanship contest in Angren, Dol Blathana, and Lobinden. Oh, that's a bit much. Wow, Prime! What? But I... Shh, Geralt, grab your crossbow and get to work. <laughs> Okay. What am I going to shoot? What's the hold up? Shoot. Oh damn. Aim for the apple. The apple. Oof. Are you cross-eyed or what? Oh, okay. What the... I hate the crossbow, man. It's like... Got it. Oh, there is one. There is more. There is one more. Oh, okay, I was like, is there another apple that I did not see? This guy is pretty... Audacious feat by Geralt of Rivia. We thank you for attending and hope to see you soon. Pretty crazy for accepting this. I could have killed him here. It's a shame that man didn't shoot the elf. That would have been brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that kid. Fine work, Geralt. Wow, the kid. Well, one performance down. What of the next? There is more? You're hired. Oh, no, never mind. Has a hut near here. Ring a bell? Go see him and ask for some yarrow extract. Ooh, a mystery. I adore mysteries. Till later, Witcher. Okay, one down. That was fairly easy. I still don't like the... The, the crossbow. Like, you need to, like... Uh, you use it with Mildred Mouse and it's... It, it works weirdly at times. Quest completed. Welcome. Check the merchant. Uh, oh, he wants to go and sell me something. My goods are not swap. Cards won't either. Do you wish to split hairs all day or play? Wait, where I got play Gwent? Oh no, we already did Gwent with them. Like to take a look at your wares. Let's... Ah, fine. Let's get him. Uh, Let's get some money. Let's get all of his money. Thank you. Oh, wait, he has a win card. Already have it. Already have it. Should be going. If ever you need a partner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Why am I? This tech kitchen in far corners. Who is he? Uh... Oh shit! That's what. The what is it called? Uh... Depths of field. Like got messed up for a second. I need to be right back. <clears throat> I'm not gonna be long. All right, I'm back. Let's just continue. I don't know if I'll finish the DLC today. It feels like there is still a, quite a lot to do, so... Uh, let's try to convince Casimir, yes, which should be the door. And it feels like the... There is, yeah, still a lot, a lot, lots to do. Oh, this is the second favor, which we pretty much only started. And after that, there, there will be like a third one, so... 
What do you say? Depends on how long it takes, yeah. As a mere. Whoa! They just. Oh, damn it. I wanted to do. Oh, okay. What's happening? Fuck up! You'll not tell me what to do! What? What's going on here? In deep play, Master Kazimir sat upon his roof. Claims he'll blow himself to bits. Bought the wench pearls, silks, satins, and how the fuck she repaid me? Made me a heat banger cuckold! I made troubles. Huh. A falling out in the family? Aye. His Euphemia. She were fine. Pretty as a picture, you might say. And five bairns they has. On the short side, but so well mannered. Always bow. Ask after your health. Not at all grumpy like the Elderman's laddies. Till the day Euphemia bundled up her belongings and their bairns, <laughs> tossed them all on a wagon, and that's all we've seen of her. Master Chasm has been pure yampy since. Balling, whinging. Now this. Ah, this'll be one for the ploughing annals. Going out with a bang. When this fucking blows, they'll see the fires in Novigrad. I may talk to him. I'll try to talk some sense into him. But if he should grow angered? The wench demanded a canopied bed and got it. Silver tableware, she said. Got that too. Lacking nothing, not a thing. What the fuck else was I to give her? Doubt he can grow any angrier. Hail me little, our hallowed mother. Keep us from evil. Welcome back, and What kind of knob you got? Lately come to poke my Euphemia, eh? Well, you're late. She's gone. No, I just... Postmaster said the same. Denied it all. Swore on the balls of his gods. And the Egypt I am, I believed the bugger. Three years they bumped a bit under my nose. Then ran off. My granda told it right. Not a bloke out there doesn't want to get between a dwarf wench's trotters. Ooh, I can use a uh, axie. You know what? Get down. Now. What? Oh, hell yeah. Coming. <laughs> That's just Coming. so much easier, isn't it? Might as well do it the Witcher way. <laughs> so, uh, what is it you wanted? Want you to open a door permanently so it won't close again. I see. And what might you find on the other side of this door? A reward. Big one, to be split. Enough for everyone. If it come a week past, I'd have sent you the fuck away. But now, now I've nothing to lose. What's it I'm to do? Hmm, I'll come aboard. Easy. Uh, herbalist who lives near Oxenford. Easy. Go there and ask for yarrow extract. Learn all you need to know. Clear? As a Mahakaman Highland stream. See ya. All right, we got him. I wanted the uh, dwarf instead of the uh, other one. Okay, Casimir done. Quest updated and quest completed. Forty-eight experience points, which is really nothing. Quest completed. Right. Uh, next is prepare a cleansing mixture that will weaken the Redanian soldier. Pretty sure I need to actually prepare it, which means alchemy. Alright, is it uh, going to be quest? Probably all the way at the bottom. Cleansing mixture, yep. Wow, I have everything already. Boom. Also, I think I am going to remove Whirl, which I don't really use. Ooh, that was a... And I think I'm gonna go Razor Focus.
I'm going to level it up though. And what does that give me? Uh, adrenaline point generated by sword blows are increased by 25%. Yeah, that sounds pretty good. I think it's better than... Uh... Yeah. Because well isn't particularly good and I don't really use it, so... Yeah. That sounds a bit, uh, a bit better to get this. I like it. Uh, quest. Prepare cleansing. Oh, I did do it, so there we go. Did that complete the quest as well? I did not complete the quest, did it? What's next then? Use your Witcher senses to eavesdrop on Redanian soldiers patrolling Oxenfurt to find out where to find their cook. Oh, yeah. Alright. Let's go. Mm, could probably have waited until daytime. That's okay. Let's do a quick save. Yep. There we go. How far is it? That's it, Roach. Seven hundred. That's okay. Not that far. Mm. Roach. I thought you could jump, Roach. Hey oh my there. God. I'm an idiot. Okay. <sighs> so did you finish uh, actually uh, Dying Light uh, Hunch or not? God oh, damn it. Oh my god. I'm getting uh, stuck all around there. Oh my god. I hate it. I hate I hate how heavy the, uh, the movement is and unresponsive. 84, 86 percent, I say. Nice. Such a great game. And I'm pretty sure uh, Dying Light 2 is gonna be like really good as well. Probably a bit different than Dying Light 1. Oh my god. This is. Come on, Roach. Why can't you... Oh. Do a quick save again. What? Why can't you jump anymore? Oh my god, why can't you even go through here? Roach! Like the heck, man. This is so ridiculous. Oh um, my! What now, you piece of hell? Get out! Wait, this is not where I want to go. I want to go here. Eh, not really. I mean, I don't remember Dying Light 1 being advertised like as a heavy RPG and tons of choices. It was advertised as pretty much a sequel of uh, Dead Island. I mean, it's made by the same people that made Dead Island, so... Oh, I need to, uh, what to wait. To say? Lance Corporal Vatslav. How'd that prick wind up with us? Volunteered. Word is he had to bribe the medics to let him enlist. He mad or what? And that's just it. Certifiably insane. Didn't pass the tests, apparently. But to pay hard coin to enter the army. Thought at my age nothing could surprise me. Nothing about the cook. No. What 
do you have to say? That's a uh, horse for Sophie. You got a daughter? I do ask. Well, think on it. To marry into a dynasty like that, it'd be like living in Clover. Trust me, you do better not to take any interest in the Basodis. Why the hell not? It can only bring trouble, mate. Only trouble. Hmm. Nothing interesting. Nope, nothing. Not tons of choices, but choices. I'm trying to think if uh, Dying Light has any choices. I think it does a few, but... No, no, actually, maybe it doesn't. Maybe it doesn't have choices. It doesn't matter, though. You'll choke to death on three pounds of steel. What do you have to say? Fish chowder for supper the day. That true? Who told you? No one. Came through the western gate the morn. Saw Martin on the pier. It doesn't make. Cook like that's a right. Oh, that's a cook. Oh, I'm too close. Cook like that's a right treasure he is. No griping about poor supplies. Just the gumption to enrich our gruel. Nah, aye. If only he'd go a bit lighter on the garlic. Pier near the western gate. Should be easy enough to find. The thing is, it, it it might make people that like Dying Light not like Dying Light 2, and people that didn't like Dying Light might like Dying Light 2, so... Eh, we'll see. Again, looking forward to it. I feel like it might be a bit too human, less zombies, though, but... Uh, I don't know enough about it to uh, to really have an idea of how it's going to be. So uh. yeah, visit the garrison cook during the day and convince I during the day. So hello, there is a quest apparently here. I watched all the different uh, trailer and gameplay they had, yeah. I don't know, it was called the gameplay reveal. <laughs> Just a gameplay video. Uh, it's not here. Yeah. I mean, there has been like a few uh, gameplay videos already. What's happening here? Yeah. Why is that? Want us to plow you? Is that it? Doable, but you'll have to hide that mug in a sec. Hmm. Fuck off, I'll mess you up. Piss off before I kick your asses. We'll see who kicks whose ass. Get him, lads! Pound his gob! There we go. Is she fine? You alright? Fine. Truth be told, I'd have managed on my own. But thank D you. Yeah. You would have. Let me walk you home. Uh, yeah. I g <laughs> I'll, I'll finish this and then talk about Managed those men by yourself? Of course. Knee to the bollocks, elbow to the throat. Job done. Wow. Damn. Be good. Walk you home. Hey now. I'm grateful, sure, but I'll not demonstrate that in the alcove. <laughs> oh, that's it. Hmm. In that case, yes. Come. <laughs> Rough neighborhood, yeah. Again, I'm I'm pretty worried about uh, what is it called, uh, Dying Light Two, due to Z gameplay Master. reveal. Do you always help folk for free? Sometimes for free. So we'll see. Usually for pay. Phew. I was afraid you were abnormal. What do you mean abnormal? Here it is. Really, you needn't have troubled yourself. Eh, it's all, all good. Better safe than sorry. Forgot. Could have endeavoured it yourself. I'm almost tempted to go with this. Mm, forgot. Could have managed it on your own. Well, don't let me get in your way. Farewell. Yeah. I was expecting a bit of a better ending, yeah. 
Ah, well. What is it? Uh, I need to wait until daytime now. I guess I'll wait here. Talk to the uh, to the cook. Your wives miss me. <laughs> Do a quick save first. Mm -hmm. Must be the cook. Only difficulty mod. What do you mean? I have a bunch of mods, uh, Hunch. Most of them do not change the gameplay. Some do. Uh, most of them are just textures and making the game look better. And the only the only mod that changes actually the gameplay are uh, one where I have to meditate to do literally anything, <laughs> and the fact that it also makes that I cannot I cannot use oils I cannot use uh, uh, food during combat, and I have one here that like the the meditation that you that you saw when I meditate it doesn't. It shows in real time the meditation, which looks pretty good. Also, I can't use uh, repair things on uh, uh, during combat. I can't use any stuff that I cannot use. Uh, I can't remember. But I try to have like mods that don't change like the gameplay like crazy since it was my first playthrough. Hey, Melanie, how are you doing today? Thanks a lot for the host. Very much appreciated. Good day, fish biting. Aye, they're biting. What about you? What's that? Got this mixture. Pay you to pour it in the soup for the boys at the garrison on my signal. Nothing dangerous about it. Most they'll think is that the fish wasn't exactly fresh. It'll cost you, mate. Something dear. Uh, I can go with this. Yeah. Asking a lot, too much. How about you do this free of charge, huh? Out of the kindness of your heart. Aye, I'll help. Out to kindness. He's so nice. Signal, and mum's the word. Understood. Hmm. Nice. Almost like Witcher too. Huh? I don't remember. So I I wanted something like. That was kind of more like realistic and kind of, you know, it's not entirely realistic. Oh, and I added one mod to have a pretty much unlimited uh, weight uh, because I didn't want to give to care about the weight. So I, I got rid of that. Uh, all right, let's go to the arbalist. Where is it? Back over there. It's not that far away. I'm all right, uh, Melanie. Thank you. Cheats. That one, I guess, is uh, cheating, yeah. But, uh... It just... It just really annoying after a while. Like, at the beginning, it's fine. But really... After a while, it just... It's just a pain in the ass. To keep having to, like... To sell, or... No, to not be able to loot something because you don't have space in your inventory, so you know. This time I was like, no, I'm just gonna remove it. I'm just gonna have a max, uh, like unlimited inventory and uh, and that's it. Especially since I'm already giving myself like, uh, like a, a disadvantage by not being able to use stuff while in combat and, and so on. Come on. Got rid of minigame of inventory management, exactly. I didn't do it in Witcher 2 and I kind of regretted it, so... It just was so annoying. Oh, you, f you found something, you want to loot it? Okay, you loot it, then you go to the freaking... Uh, 
guy to sell, then you go back there and you loot again and you go back and sell. Oh my god, no, no more. Like, so, uh, so painful after a while. What exactly is that uh, stream avatar thing is that you were talking about, Melanie, yesterday? The only for a wee spell now. Is that so? Impossible. Only a fool would loosen their hold on a mate like you. Ah, at last, we're all here. Time to begin. All that hand, yeah. It's no jest. So if any of you has any doubts, isn't sure, now's the time to leave. Won't be able to after. The Bosodi's auction house, its vault. That's our target. Everline, you'll enter through the tower when the patrol rounds this corner. Drop us a line. We have to be inside within five minutes, is that enough? It's plenty. Splendid. Once we're all in the tower, we'll proceed to the auction house. Shouldn't see any guards inside. If we do, we'll have Geralt and his blades. Then, downstairs to the vault. Casimir blows the vault door. We go in, take the loot, disappear out the back through a secret passage. I've said my piece. Any questions? No plan B, yeah. Let's go with this. Hmm. All good and fine, except what if something goes wrong? Seriously, you're on your own. We all are. Just like that. No room for friendship in this business. Additional security measures, traps, any inside? Anything you need to watch out for? Nothing particularly dangerous. Here on the ground floor, there's a rope linked to the bell in the tower. Anyone sounds the alarm, there'll be trouble. How do we stop it from ringing? Don't pull the rope. As I said, the auction house ought to be empty. I don't expect any problems. And the vault? Is it secured somehow? Even if it is, my blend of salt, peter, cordite, and fulminating silver will do the trick. Anything else? Got a horse sense take on this. Secret passage. If we plan to use it on the way out, why not on the way in? Excellent question. Why not? Every corridor has two ends, right? Like a rope. I know the location of just one end. It's in the vault. The other, it's somewhere beneath the city. But I can't tell you where. Mm -hmm. Great. Aye, but you could. Find that location. I wouldn't need any of you. Believe you me, I've tried. Time and again. Anything else? All right, let's get to work. I want to be done with this as soon as possible. We'll reconvene in the gateway beside the tower. Midnight sharp, and everyone's to make sure they're not followed. I'll get word to the cook in the barracks. What about masks? Got a rather recognizable mug myself. I'll <laughs> tend to that. Ah, one last thing. Inform the city watch, blabber anything about this over a nail, and I'll kill you with my own hands. What does this guy actually do? Other than telling it what to do. I say we go here together now. Uh, I guess I could do that before I do that though. Uh, you actually got that now? I, I saw, that's why I was talking about it. Can't wait to play. It's a program that makes chatter appear as little figures on stream. Can run around and dance and stuff. But you have no control over it, do you? Right? I just like, they appear and that's it. I don't know. I know that someone else I, I know like has it. I think I used it once, but no. Eh, that sounds good. Let's go. If you're so damn scared somebody will talk, let's all go there together. Now. Any objections? Anyone need more time? You can pick them up and throw them if you want. Okay. As in like, you or me? <laughs> uh. Let's begin. Prime. Just one patrol. Mixture of yours must have worked. Eveline, you ready? Are you kidding? Of course I am. Alright, let's do this. Let's do a heist. Three, two, one. I 
it's clear. On your way. Damn. This one's pretty agile. It's like Assassin's Creed. Plowing city foul. Shite all over again. What? So. But wow. Pretty good. We've one minute. Move. Damn. Should have blown myself a bet. Prick and all. <laughs> yeah, but as in you're the one that can like throw people around, right? It's not me that can like pick up on like the Twitch player or something. That's what I meant. Oh, that was close. Inside. Seems my informer was wrong. Is that all you've got to say? I nearly broke my neck. You knew what you were signing up for. This is no time to argue. Okay, so the uh, chat can do comments. Okay, that's what I wanted to know. That's nice. Also, Mio. Yeah, that'd probably be the same. Mm, you knew. We'll argue that later. You can be sure of that. Agreed, past the point of no return. Let's go with this. Gotta agree. Back All right, Mio. Anymore. Need to see this through, whatever happens. Good luck. Hello. I'll have fun at your medieval themed market. You now. Thanks a lot for dropping by. What now? No one dies. Said so from the start. Whatever, don your masks and let's go. Kind of missed something here, but whatever. What was that weird sound with the sword? Nice mask, uh, there. Can I loot this? Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, it is. Whoa, hello, what's this? Letters must be old. String seems to say so too. A love letter. Uh... It was true love. I'm not gonna read it. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Fancy. Anything, but I don't think uh, a torch is a good idea here since we're like sneaky. Clear for now. Knock on wood. Good. Eyes in the back of your heads, everyone. Mind that open. I've already seen several things I'd gladly take with me. Not now. The vault. That's our target. Oh, okay. Yes, but we shall raise the starting. Pr Watch this. Guards! Guards! That's not good. That's that. Bucket. You said. I damn well know what I said. At them before they sound the alarm. Ah, uh, that's not good. I didn't want to uh, kill anyone, right? Watch out. I'm gonna put everyone on fire. Oh, damn, nice one. Everyone should have a... Like, I have a... 
I'm not taking damage, yeah. Oh, okay. Got it. <laughs> oh. This is bad. Wait, no, don't kill it. Stop him! He's not to flee! Oh man, this is bad. This did not go according to plan. He's in the freaking vault now. And the alarm. Okay, this is bad. Oh no, do oh my god. I thought we were like no killing. This is this is not going well. Lay down your arms! You have no chance! Perhaps not. But we do have hostages. Mercy, master! On the count of three, we go in! One! Two! Come one step closer and folk will die! Hold now! We must negotiate. What are your demands? To release the hostages? Buy us a bit of time, Geralt. We're back from the auction house. Not about to use... No, no. I'm not about to. No. I don't know. Not about to hide behind these folk. I'm letting them go. This is not how Geralt do things. Any idea what'll happen? Yes. And you have any idea what'll happen if you try to stop me? Out of my way. Now. I do not like this guy. Good. An honorable deed! The court's sure to consider it a mitigating factor. Now, you've one minute to come out. One at a time. Hands on your heads! I'm going. Up the chimney and out. It's grown too hot, pure and simple. Best of luck, gentlemen. I'd gladly go with you, miss. But I'm afraid I'm a wee bit too bulky. Twas a pleasure. You had your chance! Attack! Still insist on using that wooden sword. Get to work, Casimir. We'll try and hold off the assault. Well, I guess I'm not using the wooden sword anymore. Oh, am I? I mean, I want to. I just have to wait. Fire killed people, girl. Not Geralt's fire. I'm not taking any damage actually. I don't want to kill anyone. I'm not taking any damage, weirdly enough. Have you played the uh, Witcher uh, series, uh, Melanie? Or oh, interested in it? Crap. Not your lucky day. No, I killed him. I have not, I'm interested, I say. Alright, I hope they're not dead. So satisfied, conscience still clear. Yes. My own rules. Couldn't give a shit if you approve. Right. Our paths will diverge soon enough. 
In the meantime, the vault awaits. Ought to be open by now. Alright, that was an explosion. Oh, that one was. Alright. It's a really good, uh... It's a really good series. Let's go. Oh, I should have, uh... His food. Oopsie. A mighty fine whoop that was. A wee bit loud, I, on account I had to add more fulminating silver than usual, but... Uh... I'm not interested. No one's interested. We go in. Geralt, you're at the fore. Why me? It's why I hired you. Now move. With no time. Yeah. Do a quick save, too. Search the vault for Maximilian's house. Yeah. Which, I have no idea what it is. We'll see. We're gonna take some uh, some wine as well, whatever we can find. Welcome back, Hunch. Oh, same paintings were on the block. Yeah, I remember. Oh, I can read this. Oh yeah. And I'm not here to like loot stuff, but eh, uh, might as well, right? They're in the vault. Lock themselves in. Yeah, that's fine. Same paintings were on the block, yeah, yeah, yeah. including this fine piece by Van der Nob, the master from Maribor. Surrender. There is a mod there for auto looting. Yeah, but it doesn't auto loot the uh, the uh, chest or stuff like that. It auto loots stuff that drops when uh, when you kill a monster or something, which I did not uh, use it. You don't stand a chance. I wasn't uh, very interested in this, and I can see the benefit, especially when you kill so much stuff. Having to go back and like loot is a bit annoying, but. I don't mind too much. You don't know who you're fucking with. Well, on the contrary, I know all too well. So who is this guy exactly? You old greetings, brother. Brother. In years. Stone me stupid and slap me happy. You uh, you owe us an explanation. Yeah, let's go with this. Think you owe us an explanation, you old Borsodi. This family reunion. What's the point? Revenge. For betrayal. Years of poverty. Humiliation. Father left the auction house to me in his will. Horst cheated me. Had me disinherited. Anything. Everything we earned, you squandered on cards and whores. Father didn't see that. I did. That's no excuse, Horst. And it won't save your life. You I'm not sure to kill him. Stand with me. I'll not let the Redanians lay a hand on you. Give you whatever you want. Tempting offer, Horst. I mean, I'm with you. Don't bribe me. I'll stick to Ewald. Not about to meddle in your grimy matters. You know, I really don't want to meddle in the freaking matters here. Mm, so it may include a chest? Oh, that's possible, Hunch. I don't exactly remember. The one I saw, I don't think had chest. Might be possible. Again, I'll... It's... I guess it's convenient, but if you have, um... If you have, uh, what is it called, uh, a mod like this... You, you really need a mod that also uh, has unlimited uh, weight then. <laughs> Strange is an asset. He, he kind of is, yeah, he definitely is, but... I don't want to be... I'm, I'm... Technically, a Witcher and Geralt is a neutral. He doesn't meddle with that kind of shit. So... Which... He always does. Like, literally always. But still. <laughs> uh, 
You know, no, I'm not gonna go to meddle, especially not in family matters. Then you'd have done better not to break into my vault. Exam boss. Too late to turn neutral. I am neutral. Stand with me, and I shall drape you in gold. Stand against me, and you'll remain here forever. <laughs> God damn it! I can't be neutral. I hate it. I hate it. I don't want to stand. <laughs> uh, I don't like how he's talking either here. Like both are not good. I know I already have a inventory, a limited inventory hunch. I'm just saying that if you're going to get a mod at auto loot, you kind of need it as well. Uh, I do like looting myself, you know, it's like more rewarding to see what you're looting, even though 90% of the time I care. Oh. You're, you're right, Melanie, actually, and I'm the one that's kind of like breaking into his vault. And he's like, okay, fine. He vault kind of was like like pretty, uh, like didn't want to say much. But... Hmm. He's not like... What they did to him and like cast him off isn't very nice either, is it? Like they're family. And it's possible, oh, man. So? <laughs> uh. <laughs> I don't see anything wrong with that. Nah. <laughs> uh, you're right. Yeah, but I mean, come on. I mean, I'm just here for the freaking thing. I don't want to turn again the, uh, the dwarf either, you know? The dwarf's pretty nice. No, actually, actually, Melanie, uh, you weren't there, but so... What, what happened is, like, I went to that auction house where we were, like, a second ago. And I did talk to, uh, to Horst. And when I asked him about the item that I want, he literally kicked me out and he was very, very, uh, un like, unhappy, like, about me. And he didn't even want me, Geralt, uh, like, in his auction house and, like, called me, like, mutant and all that stuff. So, and he, he literally kicked me out. Then his guards also, like, like, punched me afterwards. So, you know, now that I remember this, I think I'm gonna stick to Ewald. Yeah. Because he was a jerk. Stand with you, old. Oh, and he's still a jerk. Please. Once we've ripped your runners from your ass. Yeah. Old words, mate. Adam! Oh, I have a proper uh, weapon this time. Oh my god, I'm taking damage too. Oh, come on. Oh, what rip. Yeah. I think I like that a bit better. I mean, it's balls are pretty shitty, come on. It's not like there is like a... I'd have preferred to resolve this elsewise. Stolen the scrolls, thrown you out into the street. Revenge is best served cold, after all. But I don't mind serving it hard. Please don't kill him. 
now. I beg you. Mercy. For your brother. I shall do anything you ask. Truly. He's going to murder anything. him there. Uh, anything. But they would have... He probably would have done it the other way around too. Then walk out as you stand with just the clothing on your back. Allow me one thing. Any one thing. Man. <laughs> so the dwarf's like, I don't give a shit. Give me the loot. 15 years. In the sewers. Bang. Like a beast. And you the cheek. To plead. Oh. Oh, man. He's mad. Well, Take that. I guess he's dead. Rip host. That's the biggest thing in uh, the entire Witcher series. There is no. Damn! There is no, like, Satisfied. right, Satisfied. wrong. You? No. And I won't be until I find Max Bersodi's house. In this oh, this is a nice uh, rape icon here. And it is. There. But I fear it's not yours for the taking. You see, it houses my father's will. A scroll thanks to which Ewald Borsodi, long missing, will assume the family fortune. And Geralt oh. of Rivia, who you cheated, what'll he assume? Alas, but he's free to choose anything else. No, that's not gonna work. Gents, keep calm. You tricked me. And you were prepared to let me face Horst's thugs alone. To my mind, believe him. I guess we're killing Buzz then. Max Borsodi's house. If you've absolutely got to have it, you'll need to take it from me by force. Ah. <sighs> yeah. It really is. But, yeah, what I was going to say, that's not the nice thing about Twitcher 3, is like... And like, all these sides are like, kind of shit, really. Like, as you like... Like, discover more about them, it's... it's there is nothing just black and white in this game. It's not like, oh, they are the bad guys, so... You know, it's easy to just go with the good guys. Like, there are no good or bad guys. They're all like, kind of shitty in a way. So... It's hard to, like, make choices in this game because of it. Let me turn on my light. Give me a second. Yeah. Crazy how quick, uh... Like, it can become dark now. Oh, I... You know what? Can we really figure this out? You know, he just kills that other guy. Let's just like... Get rid of every of those like freaking boss OD guys. Dumb decision. Dumb. But have it your way. Let's make this quick before the soldiers get down here. At your service, mate. Casimir, stand with me. I'll make you my treasurer. Your salary? In the thousands, mate. Sorry, Geralt. Coins, coin. <laughs> wow. Two ways about it. Oh, of course. That's okay. I don't want to. I didn't mean. I didn't want to kill the. Uh... The dwarf, though. No, why did you switch target? Oh crap, oh shit. I hate, this game like keeps switching targets for like no freaking reason. Uh. Well yeah, but here in this game you can't just be neutral, which is technically what a witcher should be. Be neutral at all times and it's, it's not possible.
you can't be neutral. You can be neutral up to a certain degree, but it doesn't last very long. <laughs> I, like, why did it target the freaking guy that was at the bag that wasn't even attacking me? I wonder if I can... Uh... Oh, am I starting back from the freaking beginning here? Ah, uh, damn it, man. Uh, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna keep uh, the choices that I made. Though. I'm not gonna switch anything. I'll uh, I'll still stick to him, even though now that I know what he's going to do, I should probably go the other way around. But uh. I'm stuck! Oh my god. You know, what is it? No, I don't know which key it is to, uh... That is a key to, like, lock on someone. Is it C? No, it's not C. It is for my weapon. I can't say shit. Yeah, let's skip this. Don't need to say it again. And it is. You see, it houses my father's will. A scroll. And Geralt of Rivia. Alas, gent. You true. And you now. Uh. I'm still tempted to go with the second one here, yeah, but no. That's not the. Uh... Casimir, sorry. There we go, now I can target. Crap! Crap! Oh. He's gonna die. Nope, I don't have a choice. Damn it. I hope that, uh... Oh crap, I won wrong uh, button again. I had hopes that if I attack, uh... Only the other guy casting me, I wouldn't have to die. <sighs> well... At the end of the day, Evelyn is the only one that made it out because she left before. No, I use the potion. I can use potions, uh, and I cannot hit, but I can use potions. So I use the uh, a swallow potions to uh, get my health uh, regen a bit faster, and I have already uh, a hit. Uh, I'm already like eating. I already have the buff from eating because I use a skill point to get the eating buff to last for 20 minutes. Which is... super important. Oh, oh. wait, I see... Uh... More stuff to lose here. Yeah. Um, all the loot. Uh, all the loot for me now. Hell yeah. That, that worked out just great. Uh. Right? Ooh, uh, oh, fiery crossbow. Uh, nice. Uh. Uh, ooh, Viper Venomous Steel Sword, which I'm not gonna use because it's uh, what is it called? Uh, it's a medium uh, uh, gear set. So I'm not gonna use this. Uh, this guy tried to trick a Witcher or Geralt. Bad idea, man. Bad idea. Let's do a quick save. Okay, I think I took everything. 
Let's get to the house. Damn candles. <laughs> Maximilian Borzoli's house. Damien's will be here soon. Damn it. Secret passage. Where is it? It's right there. I mean, you can't see where it is because of, uh... Because it shows on the, uh... Oops, wrong, uh... On the minimap. How do I blow it up? <sighs> Air seeping through the cracks. Passage must be here. Now how do I open it? That's a good question. Can I blow it up? No. Yeah, so there is a... There must be a mechanism somewhere. That I need to, uh... That I need to find. Oh, I see stuff here. That's uh, probably just some loot that I cannot access. Definitely isn't here. Oh, oh, hello, a button. Yeah. Nick of time. Now to get out of here. Let's get the hell out of here. Ray didn't mean to kill anyone. I did not go uh, as expected for sure. It's okay. When when is an ice always goes as expected, you know? Never. <laughs> At the end of the day, everyone is dead. Uh, zip. Probably deserved it anyway, so uh, their fault. So now we have the house. What the heck is this place? Alright, just have to go and give the uh, house to the uh, old grid, old gear. Let's go uh, repair my gear quickly too, since it's right there. Greetings. Can I sell stuff too? Doesn't have that much ammo. Uh, I have a wooden sword. I might keep it actually. Oh, what do, what is this? King Foltest mask. Ah, oh, this is the one I, I got. Okay. A fiery crossbow. Still does less damage than what I have right now. Yeah. Kind of a. Uh... He has no money. Yeah. I never have money. So long. All right, all grid. Oh, I have everything for you. I just know the quest that I uh, I missed, right? Nope, nope. All good. That's not here. Huh? I'll wait for it to drop. Guests, fish, and bloomers. All stink after three days. Need to chat. <sighs> Got your house. Oh, you. Got something for you. I love gifts, but I prefer to unwrap them in private. Sounds right, good. Lads, mind the barrels. Going out for a jabber with Geralt. Come. So he's gonna tell me what the third uh, request oh, is. That's better. All right. What do you have for me? Max Persodi's house, as requested. This is a pretty good DLC so far, I'm liking it. Ah, Horst must be livid. He's not. No? He's not anything except dead. His brother, same thing. A few others too. 
Stones you've got. Thought I didn't think you'd have a stomach for a massacre. Yeah, well, had no choice. Let's go with this. Yeah. Situation got out of hand. Yeah, exactly. Ah, oh, sounds familiar. There you are, drinking, puffing on henbane, and then surprise, heads rolling across the floor. I don't know how or why. I'm not amused. No. Mm -hmm. Why not? Because unlike you, killing gives me no pleasure. The boss old is aren't worth your tears. Sons of bitches to a man. Yeah. Let's see. Why do you need those papers? Why did you need those papers? To sink the boss old is, naturally. You see, I learned of an interesting clause in old man Maximilian's will. It states that his sons must meet and shake hands in agreement at least once a year at Bellate. Failing that, the auction house must be auctioned off. The proceeds to go to Bill Maria's hospital. Guess the old man sensed what might happen. Horst and Yule are gnawing on soil now. But thanks to these papers, their relatives won't get the auction house. Family's lost it for good. And the hospital will have the funds it needs to treat orphans and beggars pro bono. Nice. Oh, noble of you, showing so much concern for the needy. I couldn't give a rat's ass about the needy. May the Obviously. needy disappear along with the city. I wanted one thing. Revenge. The Borsodis. What's your gripe? Get kicked out of an auction? Worse. They evicted me from my home. Oh, wow. Well, Are you okay. really interested? Yeah, I sure am. Wouldn't have asked if I wasn't. Ha! <laughs> Cheeky as ever. My family. They took on some debt. A poor investment in a sawmill. A bad crop one year. A lawsuit lost. You know how it is. When it rains, it pours. We needed but a few weeks to recover. But Horst Borsodi had acquired our debt. All of it. Demanded it be repaid immediately. I pleaded. I begged. I tore open my shirt at his threshold. Ugh. It was like talking to a wall. I went to the auction. Saw those perfumed pricks by my father's sword. My mother's death mask. My brother's horse tack. Ah. Horst earned a pretty pile selling our mementos. No surprise the animosity you feel for him. That was but mm. a start. My Iris's parents learned of my family's misfortune. And our betrothal was no more. They found her another suitor. One from beyond the sea. The anger I felt. I thought I'd gone mad. Went to the tavern. Drank around. A second. A broad. Then had another tankard. And then... Then, I asked the wrong bloke for help. What things Yarlo I did for him? Oh, I um, uh, I I showed uh, his brothers uh, at the time of his life or something like that. His dead brother. So I spent time with uh, his brother at uh, like a uh, a wedding with uh, Shani. What happened yeah. then? What well, happened then, Witcher, was one big stinking pile of shite. Well, why do you stand there? Do you need something still? Well, yeah, a third one. A third request. What is it? Third task. Third wish. Time you stated it. A moment, Geralt. I will say to something. Then we'll chat. You there. Yank the herring out the barrel. Is there someone inside? Yep. Come on. None of this dallying. Surprise they can stand. Now, ready to listen. 
Or do you still not give two shites about what I've got to say? I'm ready. I'm listening. Good. You'll return to your lord and tell him as follows. His demand was brazen. Hurt me to the core. For I was brought up to respect the sacred law of hospitality. And I shall not bend to an uncouth boar's dictum. Understood. I will pay him a visit shortly to test his willingness to adapt. So you ride off and announce me. And don't spare your horse. Got it? Aye, uh, got it. Give this man a mount and leave him go. Come with you. We must talk outside. The theory believe this is not my normal outfit is out of doors with the gods as witnesses why were you keeping that man in a barrel yeah barrel what was that about on the way here we stopped for nourishment at a tavern belonging to one Lord dauntless we enjoyed ourselves as one does at an inn raucously our antics were not to the liking of this dauntless Sent a man to warn us that if we were ever to return, we would hang. You burned the inn down? I left ample compensation with the innkeep. But it seems the rapscallion neglected to mention this to his lord. But that's of little import. What matters is someone called me a horse and threatened to kill me. It was one of those threats that sound like an invitation. I intend to accept it. Return to those parts. I like him. He'll get what's coming to you one day. Enemies along the way. Yeah. Maybe not today and not tomorrow, but someday someone will find a way to take you down. And that should trouble me why. I feel no fear, no regret. The wise men of Oxenfurt claim there are no gods. After death, there is only the void. I've known this void already. Death holds no surprises. Damn. Fulfilled two of your wishes. Time I learned the third. Confident, aren't you? Proud, sure of your strengths. Fearless. Third task, if you don't mind. Mutations. They stripped you of emotion. Tell me, have you ever loved? I mean, truly loved. You don't give a shit. I almost no. I think it does. I go with yes. Yeah, I've loved. Can we get to the matter at hand? Perhaps instead we ought to sit down inside, have a good chat over some fiery water. Once it's over, once the job's done. I know that Gerald doesn't seem to like him very much, but I'm uh, I'm actually liking him a bit so. Uh, sorry, Witcher. We'll drink sorry, Geralt. Done. Afraid that's impossible. Succeed, and that's the end of me. Fail, and you'll not be back. Third wish. Still waiting to hear it. Why? Aren't you stubborn? Fine. Listen well. I had a wife once. The day I saw her last, I gave her a rose. A violet one. Bring me that blue. Wouldn't mind reminding myself what it looks like. <sighs> really? When was that? How long's it been? Flowers wilted and turned to dust by now. Yeah. You wished to hear a wish. Now you out. Fulfill it. I ride now to visit this dauntless. But one of my men will remain here. He'll know how to find me. That is, of course, should you succeed. At least you can tell me where your wife is. Dead, well, most likely. East of Martin Foy's farmstead. I'd wish you God's speed, but... Well, you understand, I'm sure. Goodbye, Geralt. I mean, clearly fulfilling his wish means he's probably not going to be mortal anymore, which is why he said he was going to die. And... If I fail, I die? Okay, that means it's gonna be like a pretty big fight. Not sure what we're gonna fight, but... Okay then. This mutation was special. So much that his hair turned white after that. Wasn't it that other guy, uh, that other witcher that had the... Uh, 
White hair as well. Was Geralt's mutation really that special? I don't remember uh, the game ever telling anything about that. At least not like voice acted, maybe in the books. Or maybe, uh, well, maybe in the books in the game, I meant. Probably in the books as well. Let's go. Probably wait until daytime. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> he was old with me. Well, yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, I guess I'm trying to think about the other one, and yeah, his hair isn't uh, isn't white. Why am I? Am I going through here? This is not uh Yeah. I can't save. Probably because I'm uh There we go. Random weekend knowledge, I see. And I don't have a sure source and just uh, a weaker page, though. Not saying it's a lie. does seem like the mutation thing is like pretty different for every witcher anyway. It's something extremely risky and all. Wait, this is daytime. Oh, it's 3am. Why does it feel like it's almost day then? Huh. So loud. Ah! God scared me off to Not so loud, I said. Fog's not natural. Could be something in there hiding. Foglets or air nymphs, for example. Don't want to attract them, believe me. F foglets. Oh sweet mother my little why I ever I hate foglets. Good question, yeah. Good question. What are you doing here? See, Kendrick and me, we thought man has been empty all these years, full of fine things, going to rot. Mm hmm. So you're a thief. Yep. Thief steal from the living. W what's the arm taking from the dead? Kendrick went to wow. the door. I stood watch. Suddenly heard his lamp smash. Then nothing. Quiet. Called out to him, but. Hmm. What, what, what was that? One of them foglets you spoke of? No. No. Phew. That's the stone off my... I'll see what that was and look for your partner. You... I ain't about to wait around. I'm out of here. Yeah, you better freaking leave. Pretty sprawling, this estate. I guess I, I've been here before. How am I going to find that rose in this fog? Yeah, that's a really good question. Search for the partner, use your witcher senses. Search for the ground. Yeah. I'll check. Fresh manure. Pretty dark. Yeah. 
Uh, it's like 4 a.m. So. Water's ice cold. Mountain stream cold. I do have a, which. I probably shouldn't have used it, but. I have another mod that changes the lighting a bit and it does make dark places way darker than they would be in the uh, original lighting. Rather worn. Which often wonder by who. It makes like other lights like a lot better. But for the purpose of me streaming I probably shouldn't have used it, but pff, since I've done it since the beginning now it's Someone's a bit too late. Tending to the flower beds. No violet rose though. A grave here. No, oh, you could see that man's face. Come on, couldn't have been that bad. Woods rotted completely. But yeah, it does make like night actually night. As well as like caves being pretty dark, so I keep I have to use cat potion. Beehives, well maintained but dormant. Well maintained, so no someone rose here, maybe somewhere out back. Yeah. Pick over there first. Yeah. A busted lamp. The grounds trampled. Oh, I need to check my uh, my gear because this is not my normal. Somebody dropped normal something piece. this way. A body. A body. Scenes from a marriage. Uh, yeah. <laughs> this looks so good though, the new moon armor. But I was like. This is not how my Witcher looks like usually. It definitely felt uh, different. There we go. We'll actually have some armor this time. So I've been fighting with this for, uh, for a bit now. Good job, me. Still don't know when you get Grandmaster. Again, I'm pretty sure it's for, with the other DLC that I will be doing after. I get anything here. Oh, uh, a mask. Already had. Uh, let me check the quest quickly. Some more secondary now. Follow the tracks. Yeah. Someone dragged a wounded man through here. It looks like it's going to the back, so. Uh, let me do a quick save. It's a lot of blood. <laughs> oh, is that a cat? No, I don't know what that is. Looks like Thanks a cat. Long kitty, this place. What's that? That digging. I don't know why it's so freaking loud. What the heck is that? A lockpick? Must have been the other thieves. Okay. Probably be scared of this. Let's see. Let me do another quick save here. I go here? No, it's all locked. Okay. Hello. Who are you? I hear f wings. No. Not wings. What the heck is she? I'm guessing it's his wife. Marked. Laid out in rows, like garden beds. I'm liking this DLC so far. Hear me?
and I wasn't expecting much from it. I was the Tucson one seems to be the one that's like super good, but this one actually Other really thief. great. Bodies mutilated. Who are you? He's clearly digging a grave. That's gonna be the wife, isn't it? Okay, no visage. What the? Nope, that looks like a guy. Caretaker. Oh wow, okay, I was not expecting this. All that. Wait a bit. Oh crap. Oh, he's fighting something else. Oh, he got health back. He's getting the uh, health back from the uh, from the corpses. Uh, all right. Oops, I was too slow. It doesn't do as much damage as I thought, yeah. It doesn't, it barely does any damage compared to other enemies that were like two-shotting me. Pretty weird. Can't say shit, yeah. get the uh, health back again. Ah, oh, crap. I need to kill him before I do that. I need to kill him before I get his health back, clearly. Oh, using Quen uh, gives me uh, the same thing that he's using. He can he can life leech. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. I don't know how I can. Uh... Crap! He life leeched me again. He does that blue thing, he, he can life leech. Crap! Oh my god. It doesn't do much damage though, so that's a big, uh, that's a big plus. 
You haven't done uh, blood and wine? Uh, okay. I haven't done it, but I, I really like the... Uh, the theme of uh, blood and wine, so... Okay, I, can, I think I can get him, yeah. Oof. That took a bit longer than I expected. He also... What the fuck was that? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> no eyes or nostrils, deformed organs. Damn thing had no right to be alive. I'm surprised you haven't done Blood and Wine since you said how much you loved Witcher 3. You struggled with him? Yeah, he well, seems to be a... Uh... Philosophers do still debate what it means to be alive, exactly. The cat is talking. I'd be shocked, but not after what I just saw. Who are you two? And a dog. Clearly not animals. Think of us as friends of the house. You two are a little mysterious. What's with the show? The pretense that you're animals. You couldn't have warned me? No. We're obliged to maintain discretion. Alright. So why talk to me at all? Why? Well, we get so few chances to talk to humans, and we're curious to know what brought you. Gonna need a better answer than that. Later. Mm -hmm. What was this? What about this thing? What can you tell me? Friend of yours? We called him the caretaker. Doesn't look like any creature I've ever seen. Where'd it come from? From very far away. He was summoned to guard Lady Iris in the home. He tended the garden, took care of unwanted guests. Very far away? Meaning where exactly? The name of this place would mean naught to you. Okay then. You know the master of the house, the owner? Olgird von Everick? Yes. We know him, but he left, and his wife became mistress of the house. Great. So, Lady von Everick home? Could you announce me, say she has a guest? Why do you wish to see her? I'm here to get the violet rose Olgird gave Iris just before he left. Iris is inside, in the bedchamber upstairs. Take his key. It opens the rear door. Guess I'll make my own introductions. Okay. Very, uh... So, how should I address you? As you did now. We'd rather keep our names to ourselves. How mysterious. The caretaker's spade. Nice! Is it a weapon I can use? Yeah, awesome. 10% of damage dealt return as vitality. So yeah, life leech. Oh, that's pretty cool. I'm glad that it, he was barely doing any damage though, thank god. Otherwise I would have probably struggled a lot against him. I'm surprised he wasn't doing... I do not understand how the difficulty thing works on this game. Oh, whoopsie. Like... Sometimes it's super hard, and some other time it's super easy. You will die. Iris. Where you at? You mind if I, uh... Loot your place a bit? Oh, yeah. Lock. a dead end, isn't it? 
seems like it, yeah. Oh, there is something. Uh. Just a bit. You know what would be nice? Let's put an oil against the uh, spectre. Because I feel like this is what we are we're gonna fight here. Yeah. I don't know why I keep looting books. So freaking many of them now. Yeah, let's check this thing. Iris a sketchbook. What the Ooh. hell was that? I have no freaking idea. Can I check the sketchbook though? Doesn't seem like it. I... I, I read some, but... No, I, I didn't read uh, as many as I should have. Master crafted cavalry saddle. That might be a bit better than what I have. No, it is not. No, I don't really read the books anymore. Like there are just too many of them, and as I uh, as I stream, I just I don't want to sit there and read books for like a few hours, you know. <gasps> uh, even like quests and like stuff that isn't voice acted, I I barely uh, I barely check them now, which isn't very good, but. Uh. I got just spoiled by the game telling me where to go and what to do and so on. I've never known him. A different man then. I am, he looked pretty young here. Holy crap. I open this? No. I did read some books when I was uh, interesting or uh, I checked, like, for example, the glossary for, like, some of the characters, but, yeah. It's just too much. I'm too lip. I'm too freaking lazy. Hmm, tidy, and everything is clean, ready for a meal to be served. Caretaker must still set the table. What the... The game is trying to spook me. It's not working. Not very spooky game. I was spooked, yeah, really. Uh, I played uh, uh, Observer not too long ago. That was a spooky game. <laughs> uh, but yeah, the music is so uh, so calm. I know this is a Witcher and all, so no, I'm not really spooked. Is anyone at home? <laughs> you have to do better than this if you want to uh, to get me, just saying. Oh, I'm guessing that high risk with all grid. Families are all alike. Every unhappy family is unhappy in its own way. Yeah. Fire damage. Interesting. How is that interesting, Geralt? Crap. Did I drop in a place I shouldn't have? Yeah. No point to go there. Uh. And I want to check a bit more over there. There's stuff I missed there. Yeah. I even go to the other side. 
Uh, doesn't seem to be anything now. A staker, a staker is supposed to take care of the place. Well, yeah, he was supposed to be here. Yeah. At least he did some of it. Okay. Doors opening by themselves. I go here. Hello? Let me save actually. Open this one. Let me get the flowers. Oh. That's in. Oh shit. This is dark. Hello. A race. Yeah, I kind of expected it. She's getting health back. I don't like a uh, race in Eden. That's so annoying to use. They don't do any damage. Am I playing it like super easy now? Geralt. I have no freaking idea. Am I still this much? I don't know, I guess those mobs they don't supposed to be doing damage at all. I am not using any mods that could in any way alter the difficulty of monsters. So no. Bed chamber. Iris was supposed to be here. And a bunch of monsters from before in this DLC have been doing a lot more damage, so I don't know why those ones just don't. Mm. What? The enemy scaling means that uh, uh, all, of, all of the enemies are going to be your level. Like for example a wolf instead of being level 5 in the wild is going to be like your, around your level. I didn't want that, so I, I don't have it. What's this? Portrait of Hyris and Old Girl. It is possible. Well, no, because they clearly had like lots of HP here, but it's possible. Well, I want to say, yeah, it could be, but the frog. 
that you the first boss of this DLC, the frog, was super freaking hard. So I don't know, it's really weird. Anyway, looks like this is her. Gotta be her. Damn it. Yeah. Doesn't matter how much, does it? You wish to see her? Here she is. A man should frame his wishes carefully. It forestalls disappointment. This some sick joke. Why didn't you tell me she was dead right away? That was pretty obvious. <laughs> Which uh, you didn't ask, Geralt. We can't. As for the caretaker, the one you cut down, while still alive, she ordered him to stay away from her for all time. Oh, all right. Uh, why are you helping me? Yeah. The deeper I get into this, the more I gotta wonder. Why are you even helping me? We were summoned to serve Iris von Everick. Our mistress died, but that did not free us from her service. Got it. You want to leave this place, leave these bodies. <laughs> Surprised. Not really. No, not at all. How did she die? How did she die? Don't see any wounds, evidence of a fight. Her heart burst. Meaning what? A heart attack? No, it simply burst. Your heart dot just simply I burst. To believe. Yet that's precisely what happened. One day Iris locked the front door, lay down here and died. From grief, from loneliness. All right. Her ghost's restless, angry, attacks intruders. Know why? Lady Von Everick has endured much hardship. She's unaccustomed to guests and not fond of strange folk. She can't hear us. Need to talk to her. Seems I gotta speak to Iris's ghost. It's no easy task to contact the mistress. Rage and bitterness fill her. Got my ways. To make contact with Iris, I gotta bury her body. But that caretaker's macabre little cemetery won't do. Too much blood, too much fear. She spent much time in the front garden. Hmm. Maybe there. Wait. Take this key. It opens the front door. Oh, thank Good you. Dog. Good dog. <laughs> uh, where am I? I'm lost. Wait, find a fitting spot to bury Iris. Uh, probably not here. Maybe over there, yeah. Where all the nice uh, flowers are. There is something here too, you can... Uh, like here, there is a there is grave. Is it here that I'm supposed to check? Oh, right there. Iris will never wreck adored flowers. But she would never want to destroy them. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. Mm, Alright, I'll dig the grave somewhere else. I will be drunk entire life of love for this game. Come on. Oh, guess I got the right spot This here. place seems suitable. Yes, she loved to paint. Did Iris von Everick have any last requests? Say how she wanted her remains disposed of? She feared death. Worried none would see to her burial or say a kind word in parting. Guess I'll be the one to do that. I don't know. Like I said, as much as I enjoyed it, and I still do, I do have a few things that just annoy me and frustrate me every time I play it, so... Mm. Let's go with this one. I didn't know who she I was, so. I know Iris von Everick, but the paintings here show amply that she and Olgird were a loving couple. Iris must have been happy once. At times, fate muddles our path, and life turns toilsome, hard to bear. Yet all deserve respite and peace in death. Yeah. 
place a sketch pad on the grave. The painting, yeah. yeah. Let's, let's put the painting. I don't know if you want to be buried with a painting of your husband, but you live together, so maybe you want to be with him in death as well. You two got anything to add? You two. Got any last words for your mistress? We don't partake in human rituals. Trusting that what you've done is in keeping with your customs. <laughs> okay, let's see if we can summon her. I feel like she's... N the remains are in The painting was maybe a bad Let's idea. Summoner. Tormented spirit, I've laid your bones to rest. Forget your wrath, forget your grief. Show yourself. Did I miss something? Uh, oh, that's possible. Well, well, she looks, uh, she looks great. Forgive me for tearing you from your realm. I need to ask you. Maybe I should have put the painting instead. Damn, that's a big uh, canvas. Ooh. She's a very fast uh, painter, too. <laughs> Should I follow you? All right. Okay, I guess we're going inside the painting. So many games are doing this, going inside paintings. What is uh, this place? I guess the past, maybe? How she remembers the this painted place. painted world. The work of Iris von Everek. Oh, I thought I could move, but no, still How do you two get in here? We exist in both worlds at once. Well, damn. Tell me more about this place. Strange place. One born of Iris von Everek's dreams. It existed only in her mind while she lived. In death, it gained substance. Pretty fantastic tale. Hard as hell to believe. Yet you'd best believe it, and be on your guard. The painted world is rife with danger. Which, you mean games that has done like Painted World? Well, the one that I remember a lot is Dark Souls, literally. You go also in a freaking painting in exactly the same thing as this. There is another game. I can't remember the name of it, though. Alright, this is lovely and all, but where's Iris? You awoke her but for a moment. If you wish to speak to her, you must tear her from her slumber completely. Yeah, oh, sure, but how? You're a tracker, right? So you examining the tracks outside. Don't spoil Dark Souls. This is a world built of memories you, blurred. You were away. playing it, uh moments our mistress wishes to forget. A year or so ago, I guess you haven't finished it then. You need to find them, restore them, summon the fears that torment Iris, and destroy them. Easy to say. It is half a spoiler since it's technically a DLC. Waiting to get remastered. Pfft, you should then. There is no point to get remastered. Really. Don't even bother with it. Oh, shit. Spectres of Olgid and his wife. But why aren't they moving? This is a memory. But it's incomplete. Blurred. You must peer closely and restore it. Okay. Uh, use your Witcher to find a way to restore memory. Painter's palette. A teapot. Tableware for an afternoon tea or breakfast.
Probably not right. Yeah. Probably not right. I don't think it's a teapot either. Right. Teapot here maybe then? Probably not right. Oh wait, there's more stuff here. Spirit, spirit from the step. From the step. Read often, well worn. I should read, but again, I uh, I don't. Uh... Okay, here, this. Perfect match. Oh, so you had to both in. Perfect match. Yeah. The teapot was just not used here. We should get a dog. Or a dog and a cat. Even better. When the rain comes, the dog will warm my feet and the cat will play with a ball of yarn by the fire. What do you think? Are you even listening? Apologies, dear. I had my mind on my book. Is it that terribly absorbing? Hmm? Yes, uh, terribly. Know what? Let's go inside. Why? It's lovely out here. The birds singing, the bees buzzing. Blissful, really. Sorry, dear. I feel unwell. I'll go in. You stay a while longer. This seems pretty sad. I got the uh, remastered version of Dark Souls. I haven't even installed it. I wanted to play for a bit, but never, uh, never did. But again, from what I've seen, it doesn't seem. Uh, It, it it really doesn't seem well said, man. Just don't don't they really don't bother with it. There's a guy here. What the heck? You know what I could use? Igni, yeah. There we go. Oh hi, Spectre. Breaking spider, no. See? Yesterday. Those spiders do a lot more damage than uh No, not even actually. Yeah, no. Hmm. Could it be possible that something bugged? Because they're definitely not doing as much damage as they should. Let me do a quick save and reload my game. Just in case. I don't know if that's supposed to be like that or not. Doesn't seem right though. I mean like, you've seen the other guys, like literally like, they hit me and I'm dead in like three shots. So that's a bit weird that here that's not really the case. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. Well, no, it didn't since I, uh, since I was playing earlier uh, with, uh, Book here flower. For a special occasion. Um, since I was, uh, uh, I restarted after. Another memory. Since I restarted after, and uh, just like the one Olgir's holding, and it, it was working just fine. It's just this place so far. Yeah, she's probably won the glass. Perfect match. Your health, my dear wife. And yours, my husband. In my land, custom calls that newlyweds be greeted with bread and salt. But we're alone for now. I need none but you. Oh, if 
only this moment could last forever. I shall see what I can do. But come in and see our home. Gladly, but I know this sounds silly. Yet the house has sat empty for so long and I'm... Afraid of spiders. I know, I know. I swept them all up and tossed them in the garden. My knight, you've seen to everything. Mm-hmm. Oh, spiders. Yeah, okay. Ugh. I hate those spiders from the DLC. Awful. Ah, damn it. Yeah. Let me take damage just to see. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm not taking damage at all. Let me, uh, let's see. I'm gonna try, uh, gameplay, but back to bo Blood and Broken Bones, but back to Death March. Just to see if it fixes it. No. I think it's normal. It just, it just weird. This one does damage though. This one does damage, you know what? I should, uh, fuck I hate those spiders. Oh shit, I messed up. <laughs> I messed up. Uh, are someone trying to see if they were doing damage or not? The big one definitely does damage, but it still doesn't feel as much as before. It, there is clearly like, I don't know. I guess it's just how it is. There is not much I can change. Some enemies does tons of damage, others just doesn't. Not damn yeah. it all. That's one shot. All right. Yeah. Hmm. Medallion's humming. I don't think the enemy scaling would uh, matter much here yeah, since they are like around my level. No, a nightmare. A what fear crystallized, one you must now face. All right. Can I uh, check around a bit? Uh, okay. Are you interested in the new uh, Star Wars game, uh, and the one that came out uh, a few days ago? A few days? Weeks? Weeks now, I think. Oh, more sick. I should just go. Uh, the new Star Wars game. Also, can I put uh, Spectre? Yeah, let's put Spectre oil again on it. Uh, look for Iris, yeah, memories. Yeah, well. A Jedi Fallen Order, I don't know how it's called, I guess. If you say so. Another dream of the past, but this one's incomplete too. Okay. Need to find more stuff. Castel Ravello, a Tucson wine. Expensive. Mm -hmm. 
feel like I'm missing some stuff. Lavish feast, trying to impress the guests. You haven't seen any Star Wars, huh? Ah. Silver thread, pearls. It all must have cost a fortune. Not pretty good. Games are pretty good too. Olgird's wife liked flowers. Judging by the ornamentation, this might be hers. Yeah. What exactly is it Just missing? And... Different than the painting. Oh. Oh, I need to change how it is from the painting. Doesn't feel like I can. These were lit in the painting, but that's not all. Yeah. Was it lit in the painting? I don't realize. Yeah, but not the last one. So not that one. The two first were lit. Not the last one. What else is different? to see uh, what else I can uh, there's stuff at the top here I doubt it oh the fire oh yeah god damn it hunch don't spoil me My darling, is everything all right? You seem pale, out of sorts. Everything's fine, really. But why don't you tell me how you fare? I'm ever so happy to see you. Except, why didn't Grandmama and Grandpapa come? It's a long, rugged journey. Muddy. They still refuse to meet me. Is that it? And what's this? We brought some of Iris's things. Her favorite brush, her cherished doll, ah, uh, and uh, this for you. Banknotes. We paid off your debts, bought them out, to avoid bringing shame to the family. Wow. So nice of Mama and Papa to remember me. Oh, kid. Now you see his true nature? I warned you before the wedding. A ruffian and a boar who keeps the company of bandits. Are you not afraid to live under one roof with that rabble? Oh, what this? So let's follow him. All right, let's follow him then. Not you again? Don't like this place. Yeah, I'm not a huge fan of that place either, uh, Geralt. It's fine though. I mean, the place itself looks great. The bedchamber. What this? A bloody towel. Blood. Oh, did she? I was like, did she gave birth or something? Night lamp. Gone. Blood stains. Someone washed their hands, then wiped them dry on that towel. Oh, that's all right. I took that. What? What time is it? It's late. Sleep. Up all night in your study again, I see. What have you got on your hands? Nothing. Got a bit dirty, that's it. Is that blood? Have you hurt yourself? 
Ink stains. I was writing letters. I shall go to Oxenfurt soon. Perhaps you'd come with me. Oh, that's a marvellous idea. A trip would do us both so much good. Then it's decided. Now, time for bed. I'm exhausted. I shan't fall asleep now. It's out of the question. Come, I shall finish your portrait. Hmm. Okay. Let's check uh, oh, most stuff I can get. Not that it's very useful now. I don't like the like old bloom effect on the, on this place. Let's remove my uh, my torch of my tail. Another blurred memory. Uh, it's too like it's all blurry everywhere. Pretty uh, pretty annoying. Fresh, as if someone just rinsed it. Yeah. She painted all geared, but the details are off. Living Tableau's missing something. Living Tableau's gotta look just like the painting. Yep. Uh, choose a place for the apple, grapes, or goblet. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm not so sure exactly Still where it is. Right. Then. Let me put the uh, this back. So, uh, is it grapes, apple? No, I put it on the right. Goblet on the back, then grapes. Grapes on the left. Apple on the right. Living. T Apple right. This goes here. Grapes left. Fits, I think. Then the goblet in the middle. Maybe on this side. Well, that sucks, hun. Huh? I'm sorry. Just like the picture. Smile a bit wider. Like this. Mm -mm. You were meant to smile, not bare your teeth. No, still wrong. Smile like you did when Papa agreed we could marry. Please. Mm. You cannot like You're useless. Wow. I can tell something's bothering you. I have a bit of work I should say to. Again. Old Geard, we agreed not to keep any secrets from one another. We promised. Forgive me. I don't wish to discuss this. Old Geard. I feel pretty bad for her. All geared. I then. Guess we're going this way. Just another quick save here. I wonder if I like close this to the end. I mean, this is the last request, so I guess I, I should be. Can I open this? No, it's locked. Not another memory? Master Von yeah. Everick's study. Here he immersed himself in the arcane arts. All right. Between a world. Mystery. Between worlds. The library of an occultist. Some candles. Blood pacts. Or on foreign presences. <sighs> a tome about parleying with demons. Pentagrams here to bind summoned beings. Lines aren't all clear though. 
Need chalk to fix them. Then I can set out the candles. Beeswax candles. What the heck did you do? Chalk. Blood. Or some kind of magic, I bet. Oh man, okay. See if I can fix it. <sighs> Black magic. Yeah. That should do it. Now for the candles. Oh, uh, place candles inside. Verticals and the circles are surrounding. The surrounding. How about this? Come back. We must talk. I got it right. Go away. I so I good. Not this time. Come out at once. Leave me be. I merely want to work in peace. Hmm. What are you doing, old grade? spell must I use, damn it. I've tried them all. I wish to end our pact. I summon thee! Like that. Damn it, smack in the middle of a raging blizzard. Gotta find shelter, get inside. I did not expect it. Oh crap. Put the head out of here. Oh, you're dying, yeah. They froze to death. Can't open here. Can I open this? Can't. Am I gonna froze to death? Shit, 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 shit. Over there. Oh, here. Oof. That was close. So... Iris and her father. Okay. Looking interesting so far. I am really liking it though. Mm -hmm. Marriage contract. Marriage contract between Iris and Olgierd. Is this when we uh, ask her in marriage? Drained to the last drop. So this is when he started smoking. A beer Mark. tankard. But there was vodka in it. Seems like Mug is there. Probably not right. Well, it isn't. But like he was like... Oh, there is a Mug. So that's how he whiled away the long winter evenings. A knife, knife. covered in blood. Guess Olgir got the scars on his shoulders that winter. It's a... This. Her father must have been holding the contract. Yeah. There we go, got it. Furthermore, it is agreed that Iris shall be accorded the respect she is owed, that you shall heed her counsel and requests, and... Yep. Get to the point, Father. My patience runs thin. Gladly. On Iris's request, I declare this marriage... Iris's request? Also the divorce? Oh, damn it. I didn't know about that. You to remain with me till death do us part. 
and I've held to my vow. The old geard I married is no more. Breaking a word once given does not come that easy. Believe me. You shall stay here forever. Enough! You will not command us. You will... No. Father. Oh my god. No. Um, I like Torgrid, but... Servants, take this carcass and feed it to the beasts. I'm not liking this. Oh, I guess we're fighting. Uh, welcome back, uh, Hunch. Though he still loved his wife. No, he merely remembered that he should love her. Let's go upstairs. So do you still have, like, no, like, proper internet, or... What's, uh, what's the deal with your internet now? Because I remember, like, a while ago, you, uh... Your, like, parents removed, like, the Wi-Fi and all. Because your grades were going down. How is it now? Are you properly studying? <laughs> you didn't miss that much. I remember. We spent much time together here, the three of us. In silence. We'll take our places, the same as then. You do the rest. All right. Animal hair. So, all great left, and she stays there. Scratches. And she was all alone for how long? Question. Single place setting. No others on the table. What's happened to the giant table too? Like it's a small table now. Yeah, well. Oh, I can loot. A large clay bowl. Small bowl for soup, maybe. Uh. Oh, there is more stuff here. Yeah. A platter. Hmm. Oh, wait, there is more stuff here. Who's this? What the freaking caretaker? Oh, maybe it was a platter. Perfect match. Yeah. Let's put the large bowl here. This was yours. And the little bowl for the uh, for the cat. There we go. Yep, you got it. Actually, eat from these bowls? <laughs> of course not. I already told you, we're not animals. Oh, the eyes. Uh... Take would set them out all the same, as ordered. Another monstrosity. I begged you to stop this. Oh no, he's still there. These two are too, too many as it is. The dog and cat keep you company. This one will protect you. Care for the house, no matter what happens. Before so he kept her as a prisoner. Going on in that head of yours. I thought perhaps I could help. Now, I care not the slightest what you think or how you feel. I... feel nothing. Yeah. Just as I no longer know if I still hate you. Go, Olgeard. I want you out of my sight. Olgird von Eberich failed to understand we'd never be able to replace him. His spectre now casts a shadow over Lady Iris's every remembrance. So all the stuff I put on her tomb. What's there? Iris von Eberich's greatest fear. I got an achievement. The uh, all the stuff that I I said on her tomb and did was all wrong. I clearly did not want her to be uh, remembered as a as the wife of old Grid, clearly. Go to the parlor and do a quick save Still the same. Ah. Is 
sins from a marriage. Oh yeah, right. Face Iris von Everick's greatest fear. What is it? Can I, uh, oh, there it is. My dearest wife, letters from old gear to Iris, where I only as skilled with words as I am with my blade, especially now when an icy void grips my heart. I see how you look at me, and I see you with her. I cannot help you, but I believe I can cease harming you. This letter and this rose are my farewell. May you live in health, and remember but the good times, Olgierd. So, I mean, he wasn't too bad, but he kind of fucked up a bit, and he ended up leaving. Then she... how did she die? Oh, she said the uh, heart bursted out, right? Shouldn't it that have um, happened uh, before? Alright, what is this? Who are those guys exactly? All grid, yeah. Okay, yeah. That's fair enough. That's a nice uh, fighting place here, yeah, I like it. They do damage to me here. They are definitely doing damage. I can't uh, aim and get this guy. Why can't I? Uh, I'm stuck. Okay. Those guys do a ton of damage here. I hate this freaking stupid like auto target thing. Like. It just stucks you in like, and if you want to eat something else, well, no, no, you attack and it like moves you in the direction. Oh my god. The si again, the combat in Witcher 3, I'm like half liking it. Next one, this one. Wow! Well, that didn't kill me. Crap, that got me. Uh, two now. You won't do it. Oh, cr oh shit! Live happily ever after. Maybe I should use controller to fight, you know? It feels like it was it would be a bit better with a controller, but
Got him! Ja, det er veldig opp. I don't think so, uh, Hunch, no. There is like, the biggest complaint I have with this game by far is the movement. It just feels sluggish, it feels slow, it feels heavy, and it just all around not good for me. I just don't like it. And this is what frustrates me the most. I am not, no. Hello. Wait, I want to talk. You look great. Not here. Not in this place. And there is a setting to make the movement a bit more responsive, but still, it still just feels... Mm. I don't know. I just... Yeah. Like, just, like, compare... I'm sorry. The, uh... I mistook you for another. For Olgird. I thought he'd returned. To me. What are you? A ghost? An illusion? I am sadness. Mm. Exact same problem I faced with Witcher 2. Well, Witcher 2 also has a bit of that, but since Witcher 2 is not as open, since you cannot jump in Witcher 2, it's not as annoying as here to me. Because this game, Witcher 2 is like pretty straightforward, like the map design is completely different than Witcher 3. In Witcher 3, since because it's so open and all, it's so much stronger. And... <sighs> saw you before, but you weren't yourself. And I saw you again in your memories. We've met. I don't recall. I had bad dreams. That is all I know. <sighs> I'm trying to think of, like, uh... A third person game because I was gonna say oh look at Dying Light uh, movement but Dying Light is a first person game so it doesn't really apply it's not exactly the same even though it's up to a certain point so I don't know I've come for the violet rose old gear gave you on the day we saw one another for the last time I drew it parkour, yeah. and placed it in our chamber at my bedside. You could uh, compare it to uh, Assassin's Creed, there for, days, for example. Staring at it, until at last it crumbled into dust, as did I soon after. So, the rose is gone? Not from this world. Look, you buried my body and the flowers bloomed once more. And I... I was held in a deep, dark sleep. Only now have I awoken, just like my beautiful rose. When you placed the painting on my grave, I remembered the day of my marriage. Okay, so I guess I got the right one then. How is Olgird? Healthy? Does he fare well? How do you still like him after everything that happened? Like. What? what? Uh, but, you know, I, I put, like, Assassin's Creed as an example. And I just realized that Assassin's Creed movement was also the thing that made me, like, un be annoyed at the game. Because it had a lot of issues with the, uh, with, with the movement due to how you, uh, you were, like, moving. I'm talking about, like, the early Assassin's Creed, because I haven't played the new one. So I don't know how the new ones are, but the early one, you had to, like, hold space to, like, uh, run. And it was also the one to, like, pretty much do everything. So maybe just me and third-person games that just doesn't fit really well. I like the, uh, I like, first-person, I guess, a lot better. It just, it feels better. And I love, I love the Assassin's Creed. Like, I used to be, like... Assassin's Creed used to be my favorite series. I played Assassin's Creed 1 like 100%, 2 
Assassin's Creed 2 and like I stopped at Black Flag the one with uh, the pirate and all that stuff because I don't know I kind of grow out of the more well, Assassin's Creed thing as well as they completely changed the story they scrapped all the stuff that I kind of liked about Assassin's Creed story so I, I dropped it but I still I, I still liked uh, Assassin's Creed your husband's got a powerful enemy, Gontaro Dim. Know the name? I curse the day I first heard it. Oh, she knows about Gonta. And how do you step into your lives? It's my fault. It was for me Olgird summoned the Man of Glass. The Man of Glass? Fault, he wished for riches, then immortality for us both. Or as boss. Okay. Olgird will best Odin, won't he? Now tell me, how is my husband? I mean, Cryform like completely spoiled me about who the heck is Odin. So I probably would have figured out or like thought about it, but still, I did already thought about it. But uh, stopped after completing three. I can't remember which one I stopped at. I think Black Flag was four. So I guess uh, I guess I stopped after three as well because I think Black Flag was a uh, was a was a uh, false one. Yeah. 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 I still think Assassin's Creed is great. Olga doesn't deserve your concern. He pretends to be happy, but he isn't. Doing it's doing all right. You know, I'm almost gonna go with this. Yeah, I'll go with the first one. He's no longer the man you love. Exactly. So yeah, I stopped after free as well then. Remains hardened. And did did Olgird mention me? What did he say? Not much, but I didn't ask about you. He just sent me to retrieve the rose. The rose? The last I have left of him. His last gift. And I really take something from the painted world back to the real world and still be okay with it? Is it going to work? I he I heard a lot of good things about Black Flag and when I tried it I just was like Nope, no, nah, I'm not gonna play this. <laughs> I did hear lots of good stuff though, but I just... no. Got a feeling the rose is important to you. More than Some of the new Assassin's Creed look pretty good and I'm almost tempted to I get them, but so I think I have one actually. Yet when I, think I got in a bundle. I begin to recall what was. The world around me turns real. And I my eyes open wide and I recognize things. Remember who I am and who I was. I like her. I really love the look of her too. It looks so nice. Emotions that bind so you good, I mean. Feelings we witchers call pins. They're what keeps you in this world. Like an insect pinned in a collection case. Horrible. Need to be honest. If I take the rose, you might cease to exist. As might the world you built around you. And what will happen then? Shall I be free of the suffering, the sadness? Is it the void that awaits? I don't know. I don't wish to suffer any longer. But I fear there will be cold and darkness until... There is nothing at all. I can't take the rose. Well, she's dead already. Like, come on. She's dead. I feel bad though now. That I have the option to like say I can't take the rose. What's gonna happen if I do that? But I fear there will be cold and darkness until there is nothing at all. You know what? I want to say I want to see what happens if I say I can't take the rose. I think she'll be like, no, take it. You better. I can't take the rose. Is it not what you came for? Can't force Iris into Oblivion. She thinks and feels still. 
And she's no danger to anyone but intruders. Look at her. Look at her world. She's doomed to relive the pain yeah. past eternally. Take the rose. Show her mercy. What yeah. should I do? What do you want me to do? I do not know what I want. I'm so very, very afraid. You too. Uh, wait. Why do you want me to take the royal so badly? Because they want to be free, I think. You too. So. You want me to take the rose, trying to convince me. Why? We want to help Iris von Everick. And you. Mm-hmm. Generous demons? Yeah. I buy it. Because you are demons, right? What's with, uh... Gerald's face? Iris until the end of her days. And didn't come with her death. So you were sentenced to stay in the world of her torment for all time. Can't break the contract yourselves. So you need me to do it for you. If I take the rose, Iris will cease to exist. But you'll also be freed. You're right. But are we wrong to want that? Are no, 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 not the... Uh... Not the marking, I meant on the other side. This tragedy, a performance has gone on too long. We can't help the mistress, and her fate no longer moves us. Can we be blamed for simply wanting to leave the stage? Not really, no. This place needs and I'm taking the rose. Not my place to decide Ari's fate. I won't take the rose, you know? I'm gonna go with this, because I'm really curious as to what's gonna happen. So let's let's go with this. I won't decide your fate. I can't accept the rose. Will you leave empty-handed? What about your task? Those guys. Rose stays with Iris. So that is how it's to be. Perhaps in the years to come, another will appear to free us. I cannot feel bad for those now. Wisely. And though I feel no gratitude, I'll not send you away empty-handed. Look, the petal edges darken, the flower closes, and I am overcome with sleep. Yeah, she's still gonna give it to me. When I kind of knew it. Good night, stranger. You must leave. Yeah. The rose awaits outside this world, while I... I descend once more into my dream of what was. This is a very sad story. Olgid. I wish to be with Olgid. Why do you want to be with him? Into those eyes. Eyes the devil would be proud to have. Farewell. That was great. Man, that's bright. Paintings changed. Got the violet rose there now. Yeah. And Iris, ready to see her husband again. Oh, so I take the painting and show her the painting. And show him the painting. No, take the painting! Don't... Don't... Don't do it, Geralt. Don't just take a piece of it. No! Just take the entire painting! Oh my god. You know... That's awful here. <laughs> Ugh. So is it exactly the same as in the black cat and dog? Received the uh, XP? I leveled up too, didn't I? Yeah, whatsoever a man so was. So is it the same thing that uh, when you took it, uh, Ange? Or is it a bit different? Kind of curious now. 
to a quick save? Nope. What do you mean? <laughs> Can you tell me what's the difference? I'm, I'm, I'm kind of curious now. Mine was rose. You mean the, the, uh, the violet? The, uh, the rose uh, thingy? On, on the painting. But... Oh yeah, while well, mine is like darkish uh, thing. Oh, okay, okay. Darkish purple. Okay. But why was it rose then? But other than that, you you end up with like cutting the. Uh... Oh no! Y okay, okay. So no, you had actually the like rose, uh, rose. Me, I have the painting. Okay, okay. Never mind then. So technically, she's still in the painting and all that stuff then. Interesting. So, you killed her. Uh, you killed her. Oh, does it say uh, the black dog uh, thingy, guys? Characters. Are they even in the characters? Uh, I don't see them. The black cat and dog. What does it say then? In the end, the strange dog and cat did not regain the freedom they craved. Geralt refused to cause Iris von Everick to cease existing, meaning these creatures would continue in her service, for such was the nature of the pact that they had made with Allgrave. Perhaps they still keep their lady company in her dreams to this day. No man can know for sure. You saved her. That's not saving. Demons got to you, uh, Ange. Just because they wanted to be free. They didn't care about her anymore. They just wanted out. You were eternally doomed there. Yeah. Mm. Well, it all depends on... Uh, uh, life after, after death. And how anyone says it. That's it, Roach. She was not tapping, remembering our grade. Ah. Yeah. What the? Why is there a random That's dude so fast, here? Roach. Hello? Floats parched, bone dry. Okay. But you don't know if she's better now. Eh. Not the thing. This is what she wanted at the end though. I let her decide her fate. I didn't take the rose. And yet she still she still wanted me to give it to her. Uh I'm just gonna swim. Also, I didn't let the demon out. That's that's a big deal. You don't want demons out, unless they're stuck. Yeah, they are demons. The cat and the dog. They were demons. Everyone to me! To me! Alright. There was no door. Two points. Be quick about it. 
Please, good sir, a bit of courtesy. So I look up, and Bob's your uncle. He downs half the barrel in one draught. Geralt! Over here! Ah, oh, This guy is there. Wait he looks. Use the look of a man who knows how to drink. Thanks. Some other time. Hey now. Don't make me beg. More treats. This guy is awesome. And awful at the same time. Love him. Hate him. Show off. Of course I am. Wouldn't you be? Time's a marvelous plaything. And a great spice to use in gingerbread. So, you were listening. Indeed, occasionally I find time manipulation irresistible. Controlling it offers so many appetizing opportunities. Like spiking the soup of unsavory individuals with appropriately ghastly things. Wow. Tadio was put in. I mean, it's not like I didn't really like think about it or figure it out, but yeah. I still don't really understand what's the deal with him and all grid and exactly what's happening and all, but I'm sure everything will be uh will be told in a moment. I'm ho really hoping that I'm close to the end here. Who are you really? Gontaro Dim. Also known... Not what I'm asking. Ah, so you'd rather know what it is I do. In brief, I give folk what they ask for. You might say, I simply grab their wishes. And get them into trouble. Awfully noble of you. Get them into trouble. Ah, oh, damn it, why is it a choice here? Let's go with this. Be downright noble if you didn't always demand something in return. Law of the market. I was not the one to coin the phrase, nothing comes free. You're not human, that's clear. So what are you? A demon? A djinn? Do you really wish to know? Yeah. Yes. No, Geralt. You don't. This one time I shall spare you and not grant your wish. All who have learned my true name are now either dead or have met an even worse fate. Yet I still need you. Okay. What was I gonna say? So, yeah. Like, he clearly wishes for something, so how come the, the other guy has something over this guy here? Like, this is what I don't really understand. He grants wishes, but demands something in return. Yet here, there is something you that gone wrong. Time, or is this just some conjurer's so, I'm really looking what forward to make? what's gonna be. Big one. Hmm. Let us say, time has always fascinated me. So, I taught myself how best to use it. Why time, of all things? Geralt, there are four dimensions. Length, width, height, and time. What would you have me fall in love with? Width? Come now. You will see it. Well, yeah, I hope so. So, to what do I owe the pleasure? I wanted to congratulate you. You acquitted yourself splendidly with all geared. In fact, you've almost satisfied your debt. Was supposed to fulfill his three wishes. Did just that. This is where you remove the brand, because we're even. Nearly. To fulfill the terms of the contract to the letter, you must do one more thing. Draw all gear to the temple of Lilvani. We never discussed that. Oh, but yeah. we did. As a man of the world, you should know that every contract contains a catch or two. Small print, which, nevertheless, changes the ultimate meaning of the pact. This applies to oral contracts as well. Recall that I said, and I quote, I believe, however, that all will end well, and once it does, we three shall meet and thank one another for the voyage we shared. End quote. Mm, 
yeah, I remember. Fulfill your end of the bargain, and I will remove the brand. You keep saying that, but you keep fucking me over. That was the last time you interrupted me while I was talking to someone. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, wow. Uh, great. Man, how great would it be if... Why is there a fly in my soup? I was waiting. I had an eye out for you. Didn't see you come in. How is it you're here? I'm quick, real quick. I can control time. Like, can you believe, like, being able to control time? How great would that be? Oh, man. I'm a witcher. Superhuman quickness. Just one of my many qualities. You toss this fly in my soup? No. No. Now listen carefully. Tell your Ataman to come to the Temple of Lovani. It's south of here. Entrance is inside a cave. <coughs> What's the commotion? Lovani's temple. Got it? Aye. Got it. Hold that! Your friend. The medic. She were here. Ask that you look in on her. Thanks. Alright. Guess we're gonna check, uh... We're gonna see Shani first. And that guy's dead. <coughs> optional talk to Shani at her home. Well, that's not optional. That's like obligatory. No, you're not dying. Fuck. Looking to make some coin too. Hey. Is it here? What the heck happened? Oh, Which quote? Geralt. Good thing you're here. The quote you just said. What happened? Somebody break in? This? Uh, no. Just getting ready to move. What? When? when where to? Uh, not what I wanted to talk to you about. Or at least not only, but... I'm leaving, Geralt. The Eastern Front beckons. I'm Kedwin bound. Oh. Never mentioned you'd be moving. Any intention to either. I didn't know I would be. Found out this morning. Oh, that sucks. Two soldiers came to my door, said Redania needs me again. Couldn't turn them down? Just say no? Uh, perhaps I could have. But I didn't want to. Treating the ill and wounded, it's my calling. No place I'm needed more than at the front. Let's go with IC. I'm not gonna go. Any chance we'll see each other again? I'm not gonna say I had to not Some go. Day, I'm sure. So, learn anything about Olgird? Well, I abandoned the books quickly. Decided that if I was going to learn the truth, I'd need to find someone who knows him. Find anyone? Turned out I didn't need to look far. A colleague at the Academy, an assistant to Professor Premathine Shakeslock, claims Olgird von Everick met with the Professor multiple times. Apparently, Olgird asked the Professor to do some research. Ah, it's professor too late. Professor got so worked up doing it, he went daffy. Started jealously guarding his notes. Wouldn't even let his assistant look at them. The Professor, where'll I find him? Here in Oxenfurt. Cloistered inside his house on Academy grounds. Mage hunters guard his door. Wow. Mage hunters at the door. He under house arrest? I can't say, really. Some of the faculty think him a traitor. Say he sold out to the hunters for a hefty pouch of gold. The assistant, on the other hand, insists the professor wants him there to protect him. I don't know what from. What's your guess? He's certainly useful to them. A specialist in black magic and the occult? Must be a trove of knowledge. If he's really gone off his nutter, I wouldn't be surprised to see them using him. Need Guess we're gonna see the professor. professor. We'll go together. Redanian guards all over the academy. Doubt you'll get in alone. Guards have never stopped me, you know that. Mm. Wound these, and I'll have to patch them up. Besides, we might run into a friend, get inside free and easy. Oh, that sounds good. 
I guess we're gonna run into a friend. So how are things at the Academy these days? You mean since Radovid shut it down? I mean, is it well guarded? Might be all it is. Many of the faculty fled to the far north. The braver ones stayed, but assumed the guises of tailors and laundresses. Why? Just curious. Scholars seem to have adopted mage tactics. They in the same bind? To Radovid, there's little difference between the two. Seems to tolerate you well enough. Because he needs me. For now. So, the Eastern Front, and then? Depends where they send me. Wherever it is, take care of yourself. Always. Yeah. So don't worry. Aw, she's nice. I do like Shani. Oh, good. Where are we going? Halt! By order of King Radovid, no one's allowed inside the Academy. Not even lecturers? No one means no one. See, you've become quite the stickler, Norbert. You were much kinder when I was patching you up. By the way, how's your knee? Fine. Dandy. As if no arrow ever struck it. Consider yourself a lucky man. Because if I'd not decided to operate, you'd be a cripple to the end of your days. <clears throat> Bruno? Hey? She's great. Maybe we ought to let her in. She's a decent lass. Not like to steal nothing. Hmm. All right. But alone. Which will draw too much attention. I'd rather not get shite from the captain on his account. Here's what we'll do. I'll go in, then help you sneak in around the back. How? Don't know. I didn't think That's about the Skyrim good. reference. Usually aren't nearly yeah. as many guards on the riverside. Agreed. All right. Let me in. <laughs> I didn't think about it. Yeah, definitely is one. Uh, uh, how do I move around? Something I never do is really like jump on the... Uh, let's do it. Save because I might kill myself. Let's see. Jump on the uh, what is it called? Uh, the uh, the building and stuff like that. This doesn't got parkour. Well, it's not parkour, parkour, but it does have it. As in, like there is like hidden chest and stuff like that that you can find as you uh. Oh my god, I'm getting my ass kicked here. Why did you attack this one? Nice. I like that silver. That finally worked. Geralt, Psst. are you there? Yeah. I never use bombs now. Grab the line. I never liked it, and I never use a crossbow either. I don't like it either. I just. Where do you get the rope? Uh, long story. I don't know. But we've done well. Professor Shakeslock's house is at the end of this street. Witch hunters guard the door. Doubt I'll be able to sweet talk them. Been a huge help already, Shani. Thanks. It was nothing. Really. It's not that. It you just. Done the same for me. There's nothing with like if the the you key. Wish to see yeah. me again before I go. I'll be at home. Packing will take some time yet. All right. Be seeing you. It just they're like slow to use, and I don't find them very uh very interesting. I'm not saying that. That's the case, I just... Yeah. Right, I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Meditate for an hour or something. I should have meditated for a bit longer. Damn it. Because it's not gonna be enough, yeah. Yeah, shit.
Oh, I, m I think I messed it up. It's not gonna meditate, is it? No, it's not. So, oh, come on, it's a bug, yeah. I already cheated on uh, Yen. It's fine. I should have seen cheating on Geralt uh, a lot there. You don't know that. We don't play as a... We don't really see a, a perspective. Oh crap. Well, I guess we are fighting uh, witch hunters. Okay. I wanted to avoid it, but... What? Why are you... Well, no, you can only assume she isn't. Nice uh, damage. Yeah. Damn, you're ugly. Crap. Nice one, yeah. I guess I don't really mind too much killing witch hunters then. <laughs> Not that I have a choice right now. Let's get all the uh, a nice loot. Very dark here. Yeah. Get my torch out. Oh, there is more loot, yeah. There we go. <laughs> Yeah. I don't know, usually uh Gerard say that to uh Lock tight. Need another way in. You leave a window open maybe. To like monsters, so yeah. Pretty uh pretty rude of him. Uh. He's dead though, so it just will be the last thing he heard, you know. That he that Geralt fi found him ugly. It's okay. Guys, used to it. Uh, I don't. I don't care about loot. I don't know if I can. Uh, if I can jump here. And says yes. Like, 90% of the loot is just fodder to sell and get money, adds it. Which is kind of what annoys me a bit. Because there is nothing interesting in this game when it comes to loot. And I wish there was. Silver Laman. Don't know the sigil. Hasn't been used in ages, looks like. Shattered mirror. No sign of impact. Probably not an accident. Shattered by a sound, maybe. Someone look in it and scream. Really? Screaming at the mirror like broke it? Damn. Julian Alboco's lesser key. Tomes about demons. Dusty as they come. Tomes about demon? Uh, the essence of... Let's uh, read this, actually. It might be interesting. Since it's part of a quest. The essence of evil is to cause suffering. There exist many varieties of suffering. From common corporeal pain through the rare field torment of the psyche. To deep wounds dealt to the soul. Whence then does evil arise? Does it appear on its own? Or does it only spread when conditions are ripe? And finally, the most important question. How can evil be defeated? 
Most to believe evil has always existed, or not remember a time when it did not. Yet is that sufficient proof? I dare to doubt it, for I am a scholar and the essence of scholarship is to question all hypotheses until they have been rigor rigorously proven. The appearance of evil is closely tied to the existence of good, its opposite and antithesis. Good without evil is dimensionless and therefore imperceptible, evil then is an integral part of our lives. Evil wears many faces and appears in many different forms. One of them wears a skin of flesh. This evil incarnated as a man, as man travels the world, world sowing death and suffering, such evil is devious and difficult to discern. We usually only note its presence when it's already too late. In my scholarly wanderings through the myths and legends of a great many culture, come across descriptions of a certain individual which all display a striking similarity. I do not, I do not mean in terms of this individual's outer appearance or name, but of his modus operandi. This evil works through trickery, tempting at first with the other with the offer of something seemingly good. The price one must pay for this object of temptation, however, is enormous and non-refundable, and the promised good often contains horrifying, horrifying hooks and treacherous traps. Beware, then, of any who promise the impossible, for such can only be delivered for the imaginations of evil. Hmm, interesting. I wonder if they're talking about uh, uh, the, the other guy, Odim guy. Hmm. Still reading this just barely here, yeah. just checking if there is anything actually interesting. The Master Swordsmith Quest Sword. What what was wrong about it? Oh when you, where you needed to uh go uh, where the troll was to get the uh the tools. Something that's uh, yeah. yeah, let's go. Let's do a quick save. Frank Colt, is that you? Leave the bedpan in the usual spot and take the platter. He's I shan't be eating today. He's doing the same thing, Professor Shakeslock. Who the blazes? How do you get in? Get out. I He's don't, blind. Don't wish to know anything. Understand? No, no, no. Out. Not gonna hurt you. That demon sent you. I'm sure of it. Uh, what about it then? At Torin Novigrad. Can't remember. That demon. Yeah. He's doing the same thing that uh, Olgrid was doing by the looks of it. What demon? What demon? Feigned ignorance. <laughs> Please. You know. Well, no, I don't. Daughter, old dim. You freaking knew it. <laughs> He didn't send me, but he is why I'm here. I'm a witcher. <laughs> a mutant. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Could be. Oh. Okay, I see. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Well, that's the thing uh, with this game. It's like tons of loot and tons of stuff that's craftable. Are never as good as the freaking Witcher gear and stuff like that, so yeah. But yeah, I I remember that quest. Yeah, it just it just the way the the game is tied to the Witcher universe and all that stuff, and I think it just it's not that great as like an open world with like tons of loot, and it shows. Because you you get like unique items that aren't actually unique and there are like tons of them everywhere and they just like higher level of versions you already have with like different kind of like stats on it and it just doesn't fit because not only there is barely any reason to use them, it just... I don't know, I... Uh, uh, 
I see what they wanted to do, but I feel like it wasn't fitting or like what ended up being. And I'm sure there is a mod that maybe like fixes it or I don't know. Why are there guards outside your door? You a prisoner? Protective. Oh, there is no more guards anymore. That's the phrase. Protective. <laughs> when I cannot decide my own fate, cannot breathe without their permission. What do they want from you? You may not be aware, but I'm one of the foremost experts on the occult. Living experts, that is. My mentor was the outstanding Professor Lionel Van... And you're cooperating with the witch hunters now? Cooperating? <laughs> As if I had a choice. They're ignorant. But not enough to ignore what I know about magic, witches, sorceresses, what have you. Knowledge they use for barbaric ends. But that's beyond my control. Okay, I came to talk. Came here because I need information. Think you might be the only man who has it. Hmm, a witcher. Then it follows I need not fear. I'm hardly a post-conjunction creature. What did Olgierd von Everick want from you? I curse the day I first set eyes upon the man. He appeared at my doorstep one day. Offering a sack of gold were I only to find out who Gauntero Dim is, and how to get rid of him. I agreed. Such matters are my speciality. And I needed the coin. I pored over countless tomes, delved into obscure incidents and analysed folk legends. I went so far as to travel to Nilfgaard, the library there, where at last I hit upon the mysterious entity's trail. There are records of encounters dating back thousands of years in many cultures under many names, but always as evil incarnate. In this land, we call him Gauntor Odim. At times, Master Mirror or the Man of Glass. Man of Glass. In deciphering the ancient scrawlings, I went blind. Yet I learned a great deal. For example, that he plays with his victims and thrives on pacts above all else. Seemingly harmless contracts, which drive their parties to madness. Okay. So, wait, Olgierd asked this guy to search about Odim. Okay. What else? Know anything else about the man? Gone to Odim is no man. He is evil. Evil which assumes various forms. Forget about him, or die. You're alive. Alive? Yet I live in constant fear, born of what I've learned about him. What's with the surroundings? These runes, what do they mean? They protect me. Here, evil cannot touch me. How do you no. know? He told me himself. Paid me a visit once. Fascinating. I was blind already, but saw him clearly. He smiled at me. Said he was honored I'd taken such an interest in him. He wished to thank me, and explained he'd taken a similar interest in me. He drew the circle and said I'd be safe within it. His way of repaying me, you see. Ever tried to leave it? If you'd heard how he said it, you'd be as certain as I am what leaving would bring. Wow, this is this is great. Olgierd signed one of these pacts with him. Brilliant deduction. But have you guessed why? You must know that he came from a wealthy, influential line. He must have, if the family of his betrothed accepted him. Yet did you know his fortune soured? He himself became an outcast, impoverished. Iris's family a powerful house could not accept this would not marry their daughter to a nobody All geared wished to elope the further away the better Yet Iris refused to cut her family ties quite the predicament indeed Their luck turned yet darker when a wandering witch mentioned a solution a man who would grant any wish his name master mirror the rest follows naturally. Olgird and Odin. A meeting at a crossroads. A wish. Crossroads. Packed, signed in blood. And a price to be paid. 
All geared was to sacrifice one he loved. Old Dim delights in difficult choices. He knew All geared loved two in this world. His betrothed and his brother. Vladimir. Oh, that's how Vladimir died. And soon thereafter married his beloved Iris. His fortune restored. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. I d wanted to break, yeah. You know, or is this from Olgird? Olgird tell you all that? He had to. How else was I to diagnose his case? Make it sound like an illness. It is worse. Many illnesses are treatable. But play with evil. Medicine can be much harder to find. How is this optional? So did Olgird kill his own brother? No. Oh, no. Deduce, Witcher. Odim acts directly or indirectly. Hmm? Olgird merely signed the blood letter. The next day, his brother was dead. Yeah, damn. Why was old geared out to get rid of Odim? He'd gotten what he wanted. Had he? Yeah. <laughs> his heart had turned cold as ice. His feelings for his wife, for whom he'd sacrificed his brother, had withered. He'd lost all he loved. Had he wanted any of this? No. Odim grants what you wish, not what you want. All who sign a pact learn the difference and die by it. All? No way to get rid of him? Kill him, you mean? Kill evil? <laughs> no. Yet the annals tell of a man who dissolved his pact by defeating Old Dim at his own game. Meaning? Old Dim wields contracts, word traps, duels of wits. Challenge him to such a duel. He'll agree. And can be beaten. But remember, there is only ever one stake. Soul thing he truly desires. Human souls. Wait, so it's actually like OG Mix what uh Python said he was, maybe not. Heart of Stone, yeah. Heart of Stone. That's damn I didn't think about it until like right now. Or oh, until you you said it, yeah. Okay, that's awesome. Oh Dim left a mark on my face. Any way to get it off? A mark. No mention in the tones. Strange. Unless... Unless it will disappear once your pact is fulfilled. If I challenge him, end the pact that way, will it go away? That I do not know. The one man who succeeded bore no mark. I mean, old... Um, old Grade is the one that succeeded to do that. That's why, okay. Thanks. Helped me a lot. Good. Very good. Ah, oh, to feel useful after so many years locked up, living in fear. Why, it's pleasant itself. Oh no. Wow. <laughs> wow. That's pretty freaking unlucky, isn't it? Well then, that sucks. Let's uh, let's read this. It's pretty much interesting. Could you say it was unlucky? Well, yeah. <laughs> the circle Odin created terrifies me. Cannot see near it, but I know it is here. I know no name for the sense with which I perceive it. When I near its bounds, strange shivers shoot down my spine. This is no pain, but something that stands my hair on edge like a hedgehog's squivers. A month has passed, and I st and still I stay within the, the runic circle. Nightmares frown me more and more. I've come to fear sleep. I know not how long I can withstand this. I dreamt I had a daughter. This was strange, for I've never had children. Yet one came to me in my sleep. She was no older than ten. She called me daddy and loved me deeply. 
I could see it in her eyes. The strangest part of all was that I also burned for her with a great paternal love. Can one possibly dream of someone who does not exist? Can one love such a one? I no longer fear sleep. Perhaps Odim has decided to give me peace. I had no desire to change his mind. My dreams of Amelie give me great joy. My daughter is good and clever girl. I believe she will grow into a wonderful woman. A shame she exists only in my dreams. Not only do I no longer fear sleep, but now I cannot wait for the moment in which it comes. What a fantastic transformation. If nothing changes, I shall soon try to leave the circle. I know now why I dreamt for weeks of the child I never had. It was his doing. This night my, no my daughter died. She caught a strange illness which pocked her whole body with hideous oozing sores. She cried, begging me to help. I could do nothing. She died in my arms. I awoke, soaked with sweat. I remain a rake, my mind tattered. Three months, late, three months have passed since Amelie's death. My heart still bleeds, and horrifying visions plague my every moment. I am a blind man who wishes he saw nothing, for utter blindness would be a relief compared to these tormenting visions. I cannot persevere much longer. I have become a deeply unhappy old man. I have now lived with, within the magic circle for a year. Thoughts of suicide haunt my mind ever more often. It would be so simple. I need but step outside the ruins. Yeah, he's probably better off. That's not the, uh... The door. At the door. He's definitely better off. Holy crap. Let's get out. I can't leave from here. Uh, where do I even come from? Not sure where I can uh, live from. Maybe through here? I thought I was, I was dead, yeah, when I jumped. I was like, that's it, I'm dead. But no, we're good. Uh, let's see, where do we have to go now? We have to go in uh, the temple of Lil Vani, of Lil Vani, which is the, uh, yeah, no, secondary quest, or last quest, yeah. I'm guessing this is the last quest of the, uh, of, of the, uh, of the DLC, so I'm gonna try to. Uh, do I'm I'm finishing it tonight. I mean, yeah, I feel like I'm near the end, so I might as well. Uh, I might as well finish it now. Let's go. This is also. This is pretty good. I'm really. Uh, I'm really liking it. I wasn't expecting the DLC to be. Uh, to be that great, you know. So oh, I'm happy with this. See, if I had enemy upscaling, they wouldn't be uh, four. They they would be like my level if I had enemy as upscaling. Come on, come closer. Oh, no, I don't want to fight. Leave me alone. Evil is evil. What do you mean evil is evil? Evil not just evil. Faster. Let's do a quick save. Yeah. I, I as you quote you said earlier with uh why can't I uh Can I uh there we go Damn it I uh Ah uh, whatever I'm I'm just uh like uh, about like being neutral.
Yeah. Come on. The thing is, it's not. Yeah, I don't really agree with that. Like, not a door, actually. Well, it doesn't matter if it's Geralt's coat or not. Like, easily even no long enough. What the heck was happening here? Okay, that was pretty funny. I should have kept it. I should have, I should have looked at it. I wasn't paying much attention. What? I don't know what happened to Roach. He had his freaking, uh, the, uh, his head in the, on the ground. It was pretty funny. Okay. Uh, let's use a, let's use a cat potion here. Yeah. Guess we're going inside completely, uh, uh, the temple. And, like, I don't know how it is in the book, but in the games, like, Geralt always has to choose. So, uh, in, like, every game, he always has to choose. Oh, I think I remember this place. I've been there before. Yeah, yeah, I remember this place. Oh, the game saved now. Uh, okay. I'm gonna have the cat potion, uh, I should have, uh, I should have removed the cat potion before, yeah, yeah well, it's okay, sometime later, well, uh, technically cat potion shouldn't be there anymore then, it's been some time, Strange in book how you could choose, well, no, Guessing there's a reason for it. that's what I'm, I'm thinking, like, is in the book, is he actually going through that, or is he, uh, making a, making a, uh, is he, is he choosing? Is he choosing something? This is what I'm talking. Because right now you're caught, so you're saying it's Geralt's caught, but the I'd rather not choose at all. I guess you could rather not do something and yet still have to do so. I guess that still holds true to a certain point. Uh, just catering to your love of the art, not my choice. Let's go with this. I'm gonna be honest. I assume so. No, he doesn't. But since we're here, I believe you have something for me. It's an illusion of it completely. Yeah. Fulfilled your third wish. What is this? A canvas, and on it, your house, your wife, and the rose you gave her that day. This is not what I asked for. Free yes, it is. Wrong. Not the first time, and it's been my downfall. Oh, yeah. So beautiful. She looks alive. Because she, she is. is. In a way. Iris painted this, then entered it. What? How? She loved you, wanted to be close. She wanted the pack to end. You to be yourself again. She wanted to punish you, so she helped me fulfill your wish. No, it definitely wasn't the... Uh, I think it's one or two. I think she clearly. I think I'll go with the first one here. I don't know. She loved you. Maybe she just wanted to be close again. She wished to be close. After all the past. I know. It's crazy, man. What a mess we made of it all. If I'd only known then how it would end. Oh yeah, well. What's happening? I feel as though, as though a hot iron's pierced my chest. Is he gonna die now? Sorry. 
sorry to have kept you waiting. Nice. What an entrance. See everyone's made. How do you feel, Von Everick? A little less troubled? Lighter in the heart? Or dim? What do you want? What do you mean, what? Your soul. You forget. The pack states you can take it only once you fulfilled three wishes and... And we stand together on the moon. Well, what do you know? Oh yeah, I right. Ah. Uh. What? Oh, nice one. No. We... We had a pact. The moon is there. There! Not... Here. I gave you what you wished for. Here, on the moon, our contract you fulfilled. Boss, you cheated me. I never cheat. Wait. Do not ah, damn it. Remember what I did to the last fool who interrupted me. You grant wishes, right? Grant mine and release him. He must repay his debt. Let him go, and I'll take it on. We'll call it mine. You wish to give your soul for his? No, but we can play for them. I lose, you take mine and all Geert's. But if I win, you release us both. Ooh. You propose we play. Gwent? Don't know. Maybe we can bet on a challenge. You know I'm good at accomplishing the impossible. See me do it. Hmm. Very well. But we shall do this my way. I was tempted to not, uh, to not intervene here. Because, I mean, Olgrid isn't a really nice person, but he was. Well, I guess he was, so I don't know. You wish to play, so let us play. All right. I shall tell you a riddle. Solve it, and both you and Olgird will be free. Sounds good. I'm not very good with riddle. <laughs> then we'll all three go for a wild ride. It's what you proposed, is it not? The riddle. Let me hear it. To all things and men I appertain, and yet by some am shunned and disdained. Fondle me and ogle me till you're insane, but no blow can harm me, cause me pain. Children delight in me, elders take fright, fair maids rejoice and spin. Cry and I weep, yawn and I sleep, smile and I shall grin. What was that supposed to be? You tell me, what am I? Hmm. Uh, I had to Google it after hours of tries. Does that mean I can keep trying, or do, will I? F or can I fail? I can probably fail. Let's repeat it once more here. Yeah. Didn't quite catch the riddle. Mind repeating it? To all things and men I appertain. And I don't know what I appertain means. Shunned and disdained. Fondle and ogle me till you're insane. No blow can harm me, cause me pain. So he cannot be killed, okay? Children delight in me, elders take fright. Fair maids rejoice and spin. Cry and I weep, yawn and I sleep. I really like him. Smile and I too shall grin. Yeah, let's do this. You're going down. We shall see, my friend. 
You must find me before the sand in the hourglass runs out. Red. Well, I'm guessing so if you uh, Let's begin. If you had to Google it. Uh, so I need to find him before the hourglass. I don't see the hourglass. Find the solution. This place. Master's mirror <laughs> reader. Like Plenty yeah. more where it came from. Just remember. Time remaining at the top here. Yeah. time runs out. I need to find him. How am I supposed to find him? I mean, it's part of the uh crap. Kind of annoying that you have to uh fight stuff Monsters here. Monsters weren't part of the deal. My world, my rules. Cry and I weep, yawn and I sleep, smile and I too shall grin. Hmm, something that repeats all I do? Maybe an echo? No. Echo. No dice. You can't possibly ogle an echo. Exactly. What the heck, yeah. Uh... Children delight in me, elders take fright, fair maids rejoice and spin. Cry and I weep, yawn and I sleep, smile and I too shall grin. Damn it, what are you? I go like super far away or something. At the top here? Yeah. Help! Geralt! Save me! Shani, hang on, I'm coming. This is not time waste. How <laughs> dead. <laughs> I can't believe you fell for that! <laughs> He's great. He's amazing. I want to see that kind of stuff. I don't care if he's doing it on purpose. I am more than happy to uh, to look for that kind of stuff. There is actually a way here. Oh, he's putting tons of loot for me to loot here. Unable to resist the <laughs> nice I one. Yeah. Expected more of you, uh, especially since time is short. Hmm. Oh, that sounds like a. Oh, awful! You're doing terribly. Remember, you can always give up. As I see it, you will never find me. Never. I always want to fight those, they are pretty annoying. Mirror. So this is where you're hiding. <laughs> oh, shit. God damn. That actually scared me. Yeah, I did. I, I completely expected it to be that easy. There's a mirror here. Doing that forever. Care to wager on it? Okay. He's gonna break this one too. I'll still get you. So you say, yet I wait, wait and nothing. I don't think this is this one. It's not really a riddle, because even if you know the answer, <laughs> it's just... Gotta be some mirror here you won't shatter. <laughs> <laughs> it's like... It's not like a... Nah, it doesn't feel like a riddle to me. 
It's not like I can tell him what he is and uh doing that forever. Care to wager on it? This is not uh, well yeah, no, definitely don't spoil it man. Yeah, how the heck do I leave uh here? I'm tempted to even like drop here. You know what? Fuck it. Let's see. Do I just die? I just die. <laughs> it was it was worth it, okay? I had to check if it was going to uh to to like trigger something. No, you just die. Good to know. Hmm. I'm back here, yeah, okay. Good. What is this place? <laughs> you like it? Plenty more where it came from. Just remember, you must find me before time runs out. Wait, wait, wait. Over there, maybe? I can't remember why I went last time, to be fair. I went at the top, yeah, well, didn't I? Yeah. Alright, shiny. I mean, I feel like it still like forces you to go in that. Uh, oh, I haven't been here. Children delight in me. Elders take fright. Fair maids rejoice and spin. Children and young folk like swings. Could be scary to old folk too. Uh, doesn't fit the other verses though. No, it really doesn't. Things and men I appertain, and yet by some am shunned and disdained. Fondle and ogle me till you're insane. But no blow can harm me, cause me pain. Hmm, what could that be? <laughs> oh, awful. You're doing terribly. Remember. I want to check this place. As I said, you will never find me. Never. <laughs> Oh shit. What? That range? Bullshit. Check this. Yeah, this cat portion is out. <laughs> Much better now. It was way too bright. Could be family, I guess. Wouldn't match much else in the riddle, though. Repeat the riddle. To all things and men I appertain. There's no reason to repeat the riddle. Fondle and ogle me till you're insane. And this is definitely this way. I mean, come on. Mirror. So this is where you're hiding. <laughs> Come now. You didn't expect it to be that easy. Did Damn it. You? Damn it, that didn't work. I thought the uh I thought me jumping would have uh, done something. Nope. Hello Prashon, how are you doing today? Hmm. So you say, yet I wait and wait and nothing. <laughs> I. There's clearly something I'm missing on this place. 
a good thing So what uh, is a reflection? Yeah, is a reflection. Uh, okay, I got it. So, uh. any better? Yeah, thanks. Wine's revived me a bit. This plonk could revive a corpse. An exquisitely rank vintage. You know what, though? It's good at last to taste something real. Yeah, I get it now. Reflection. So, how about it? Tell me what the blazes just happened. Your brand's gone. Nice. Guessing that's a good sign? Yeah, okay. All right. Why don't you tell me what it's like to have a heart of stone? First off, you tell me what it's like to have a heart of stone. <sighs> it's wonderful at the start. You feel no fear, no angst, but also no concern, no care for anyone, not even those you loved. And gradually, you lose them. Well, you know how it ended. What about your senses? Taste, smell. All there. At first, I savoured the world like never before. It was stronger, more clear. How's that possible? I did not wish for a heart of stone. That was a mere side effect. I wished to win back Iris's hand and have my fortune restored. And then to live like there was no tomorrow. And thus I lived until, until I ceased to feel anything at all. Mm. What a joy to be done with it. Because I am done, right? Will you tell me what happened? Also, Le Prochon, I, I don't know what to say about it. I think it's pretty balanced, but I don't know about the other. It's just, you're not very, like, you're pretty new to the game as well, so you need, like, experience to, like, get some stuff. I don't, I don't know if it's, like, a balance issue, but I'm not, I don't know much about the game uh, enough for that to matter to me, so. Animations were so unrealistic and fast. There are some stuff when it comes to, like, uh... When, when the spear, for example, like the faint on the spear, like you, you barely can see it and some weapons are like super quick, yeah. Uh, we won that all that matters. Let's go with the first one. Oh, Dim decided to have some fun at my expense. Devised a game I was supposed to lose. Seems he'd forgotten the training you put me through in doing the undoable. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so only to protect myself. In doing so, I put you in harm's way. Forgive me. Mm. Well, don't have to worry about him anymore. You're safe and free. Do we not have to worry about him? 
Though I've no notion what to do with this freedom now. Mira took everything. Everything I loved. All I held dear. Not true. Got your heart back. A bitter victory. Now at last I sense how much I've lost. I bet, yeah. I have a heart again. Yet all it feels is grief, sadness and defeat. My life is a ruin. True, I don't envy you. Nah, it will all work out. For situations, you'll figure this one out. Got a company of faithful comrades waiting. Got a home, your fortune. You're a no. tough guy. I cannot live as I did before. So what'll you do? I don't know. But one thing's clear. It's time I took fate into my own hands. Lived life anew. And truly, this time. Sounds like a plan. I'll never forget what you did for me, Witcher. I have something for you. Oh, can you give me your sword? Oh, nice. Accept this. You can, and must. This saber's been in my family for generations. Even when I'd lost all else, it remained at my side. Means a great deal to me. All the probably shit. Why I can't take it. Do me the honor. This will mark the start of my new life. And such a weapon could be right useful to you. I don't Thank think you. so. Hey, 96 experience point. Whoa. Sorry. Iris. Oh, he named it after his wife. You needn't be. I thank you again, Geralt. And good luck on the path. Good luck to you too. That's it? No, that's it? This is really how you're gonna hand the entire thing with Odim? Okay, so like what actually Cryphone like spoiled me? Wasn't even a freaking spoiler then. It, it was nothing because at the end we still don't know what it is. He just assumed it. Because there was like at the end like no like sure way of knowing what Odim actually was. Because Cryphon was like oh he's like a, he's a djinn. But I mean he probably was but that was actually like nothing relevant. Because even when we ask, he, he says, like, you do not wish to know, and you can't know, so... Just that he's, like, an evil person. So, probably, it's, he's probably not even a djinn. Huh. He was a demon. Well, was he, though? No, you don't know. You don't know if he's a demon. He wanted your soul. It could be like, uh, I mean, depends on what you you define a demon. Can a djinn be a demon? Maybe? Like, it was just like someone that granted wish. I don't know, interesting. So yeah, like what uh, Cryphon said at the end, like didn't even matter one bit. And what you said did... yeah. Hmm. Demon of Reflections? Nah. That was great. But I'm still surprised that uh, it ended like this though. That was pretty good though. I liked it. I enjoyed it. Definitely wasn't expecting this DLC to be as good as it was. The, the scaling of the enemies and the difficulty was all over the place though. Like, holy crap. 
What if you had chosen not to help all grid? I wonder that too. I guess I might check it out on YouTube to see uh to see what happens if uh if you do not help uh all grid. That was great. Uh, I uh I really uh I really enjoyed it. Cuz there is really barely any uh any way for me to like actually like do a second playthrough of Witcher 3. I do not see the replayability in this game. To me it's uh There is a bit of replayability to check some of the different outcome, but I feel like there isn't enough of a big outcome for me to like feel like I should do it again. So the gameplay to me isn't like as good as I'd like to like actually want to play through it again. I don't know. It's it's yeah. I feel like it's really a story game. So when you've played through the story once and know the story, <laughs> yeah. I I don't I don't really say it. So yeah. I mean I say that I replayed Witcher two, but I replayed Witcher two because. Uh, uh, because of uh, it, it I wanted to replay the entire Witcher series, and I didn't really remember much. You like FPS, so what do you mean? I barely play any FPS. I don't. Like what kind of FPS? Like are you talking about? <laughs> uh, I play game for the story, and well, lately now I play games for the story, and like. Gameplay wise here, The Witcher to me isn't enough on its own to to be enough to play more. Uh, if we talk about FPS, like for example uh, Borderlands that is also like a very heavy story game that I've played. Even that one is not enough for me to play more even though I find a lot more interest in the gameplay and what Borderlands has to offer because it has an endgame content, it has a grinding content, it has stuff to do. Witcher 3 or all the Witcher games in general don't really have that. The only reason to me I see to replay the game is to take different paths, which I'd rather go and play another game and spend my time on another game rather than like replay a game that I know the story even if it has different paths. Especially in the case of Witcher, which is limited. It is pretty limited. If it wasn't as limited as it is, I'd probably play again. Like for example, when I play a visual novel, I will play all the different paths, but a visual novel, you can skip what you've read and stuff like that, so it doesn't matter as much. In any case, well, we are done with Hearts of Stone, which was super good. Wait, was it Hearts of Stone or Heart of Stone? I can't remember. Because there was only one guy with a Heart of Stone, so I guess that was uh, only one. Uh, which, But for which I'm afraid it doesn't matter. Again, there are stuff that I didn't like about which <laughs> Joffrey, so I don't see myself playing the game again. It's just me. Like it's just it's just me. Uh <coughs> sorry. Uh I will definitely play So that was Hearts of Stone, yeah, okay. Weirdly enough there was only one guy with a heart of stone, yeah. At least from what we've seen. Uh I will definitely do the second DLC. I don't think I'm gonna start it right away, which means we're like, what, like Friday? Probably not until next week. Uh, but again, I am... Second was Demon, okay, yeah. <laughs> I am planning, I want to finish Witcher 3, like, fully. Technically fully, which means like all the story and quest, except some quest maybe, uh, before uh, 2020, which, yeah, I think it should happen. I, I'm guessing the Tucson DLC is a bit 
lengthier than uh, than this one since it ha it has like a new map but that one was actually longer than I thought like we're talking like I don't know like uh, six hours to death and like we're talking like maybe like 14 or so hours it took me to finish it that's a pretty that's a pretty lengthy DLC yeah. like 15 hours yeah was great. I mean, I, I take my time as well, but yeah. Totally new map. Yeah, I know. Uh, there is an entirely new area. I am I am really looking for that one because I think it's, it's, it's going to be great. I mean, I'm hoping that it's going to be great. Uh, so, yeah, really looking for that one. Uh, yeah. So, but after I'm done with the two cent DLC expansion, whatever, like DLC expansion are literally the same, especially nowadays. I'll, uh, I think it will be a bye bye for me when it comes to, uh, to Witcher 3. It's possible that I'll revisit it like years and years and years later, but. I have so many games that I want to play and I've spent already, I think I'm at like 130 hours in The Witcher 3. I mean, this is a lot of hours already, like, damn. I really, really enjoyed this game. I don't, like, a single player game that gives me that much amount of content and all that I play from start to finish is, yeah, pretty good. And that, that DLC was great. In loving memory of Carolina Groshowska, I guess she died. Rip. Well, yeah, I still have Blood and Wine, which is, I'm, I'm expecting, like, probably 20 or so hours more of, uh, of content easily, so, like, a few days of me playing it. I got an achievement. Nice. Let's check the uh, the weapon we got, the weapon he gave us called the Iris. Is it this one? Yeah. Wow. Okay. It is a lot more. Da uh, I guess you guys can... It's plus 47 damage compared to what I have right now. Weapon charges with energy during combat. When its color changes to red, a strong attack will release this energy in an extra powerful strike at the cost of part of the attacker's vitality. Okay. I mean, this is definitely stronger than any weapon, uh, than my steel weapon right now. So, I could easily use it, you know. It is better, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's definitely better, but... I'm a witcher. I should be using freaking witcher swords, you know. That's... Uh. And I'm expecting in uh, Blood and Wine, that we are gonna get the uh, Grand Master upgrade to my gear here, since I haven't seen it yet, so I'm pretty sure it's in Blood and Wine, and we'll have, uh, and we'll have like a, a set gear uh, upgrade here. Strong attacks increases fast attack damage for 5 seconds. Rear attack, still 50% more damage, and also stun, like, all the, uh, the Witcher gear pieces that you'll, uh, that you'll get. I expect a lot from Witchers. You mean, uh, from, like, the gear and all, yeah. I don't know, I feel even bad as Geralt to be using the feline armor and not the Wolven armor, because Geralt is someone from the, uh, the wolf uh, thing, so, you know, I shouldn't. But yeah, we only have one quest now, which is Envoys, Wine Boys. You know what? Before I finish, let's go, let's go finish the Master of the Arena, which I need, it's the only thing I need to, is to collect my freaking reward, and that's it. So let me go do this quickly. Is there something here? No, there isn't. Mm, that thing, uh, I also kind of like it to be the main armor that we got first. 
Which one? The Wolven Armor? I would use uh, the Wolven Armor if the Wolven Armor wasn't... Uh, uh, was, wasn't medium... Uh, let me put some light. Wasn't medium... Uh, medium weight. I do not want to use medium weight. I want to use light armor. Oh, damn. Let me not die, please. So... It's a bit annoying that it's... Uh, it's it's medium and not uh, and not light. Can't do much about it, but that's just how it is. How far is there? There is one here. S A E. What's S A E stand for? I I, I use the uh, so when I played Witcher two, I. Uh, when I played it again with the DLCs and all that stuff. There's a bear! No, a bear level 8 is trying to attack me, no! <laughs> I, uh, uh... I do have the Witcher 2 save. Yeah, yeah, yeah. God damn it, leave me alone. Leave me alone, bear. Wolf, whatever you are. Are you this? But there was barely a... Uh... Uh, I recalled, I checked what you get from Witcher 2 to Witcher 3, and you, you don't get much, uh, at all. You just, like, finish this. Like, yeah, there is, there is, like, some, uh, choices, I think. Yeah, there was choices, uh, no, I haven't, uh, I, I didn't have installed, but you, you only need a save, you don't need to have the game installed. As long as you keep the save in the uh, folder. Yeah, let me do a save as well. Hey. Let me finish this. Greetings. I like how I had to come back like a uh, a a day later. It's been like at least a freaking year now. Business is booming for as I can see. <laughs> Better believe it. Every man and his hound wants to fight in the. Cook. The game does as a save game does not uh, punch now. Must have grown sizable. Here. Oh, or give me all the money. Doing business in Skellige. Come again, eh? Great things are bound to happen here. Mark. Really? I hope they do. Good luck. <laughs> I got one experience point. 20 crowns. Wow. That was so worth it. Wait, that... Quest completed. Okay, thank God. Uh, at least no more... Uh, no more stupid uh, quest there. Yeah. Uh... <laughs> oh, I have no more... I have no side quest. That was my last one. Uh, I have no secondary quest. You can't see. The only one I have is collect them all. Which is the uh, Gwen card. That's it. I have one main quest, this one, and the uh, collect all the Gwen cards. But I've done all the side quests before I uh, I did the DLCs. I didn't want to uh, to change. The only thing I haven't done is uh, all the question mark in Skellige because I fucking hate it. <laughs> Using the boat and do all those question mark are just the most painful thing ever. So I may have missed side quest here, and you know, I don't care. I've done a lot. Like, look at all those uh, smugglers cache everywhere. It just... It, it's painful to do. It's really painful to do, so I'm just not caring. You missed a lot of content? No. No. All I miss is a fucking smugglers cache, and that's it. I mean, again, it's possible that there is a few... Uh, uh, some like quest over there, but really I, I don't care. If it wasn't as painful as it is to use the boat and to fight underwater and to do those things here, I would. I just, I don't. So I just did as much as I felt like doing, but there isn't really that much left compared to like all the things that I've done. Just a few, like, all those spo like, this is literally the only thing you get. Spoils of War, Guarded Treasure on the Little Island, and, uh, and Smuggler's Cache. Oh. 
so so annoying so freaking annoying yeah yeah, yeah. i might uh there's maybe here no i've done everything novigrad i think novigrad i there's maybe one left yeah i have one left yeah oh, another one here that's it yeah that's it and well, i don't know if uh there's maybe some here too nope Nothing out. Yeah. Again, Skellige, I just... I can't. It just... It pisses me off. Meet the knights from Tucson in Holloway. Wait, is it actually here? Yeah. Well... Since I will... Uh, I will go there. I'll... Uh, stop that. Um... Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, I'm not. I'm not going starting it today. I'm even going to like stop. Actually stop. I was going to play some Morto, but I guess Witcher Three took a bit longer than I thought. It's possible that I'll play uh, Stellaris in a little bit with uh, with Angel, but I need a break. I need to get some food. I need to feed my cat, and so on. Again, finish the Heart of Stone. Very very up here about it. Let's do a. Uh, Let's uh, stop here, and uh, next time I'll play Witcher 3, we'll start Blood and Wine. Which, hopefully, is going to be amazing as well. Would be nice to know like uh, which uh, Gwen cards I'm missing for the uh, secondary quest, but... I, I don't know, I've done every Gwent fight. Every Gwent battle that I've seen. On like even like the freaking uh, uh like just like random people I like, keep doing Gwent uh, but they, they are, I guess I don't know I don't really care too much about completing that one I'm but I'm not playing Witcher free to like completion hundred percent so I don't think uh, you get Gwent cards from uh from question marks not that I remember again I don't care too much anyway and again next it's gonna be blood and wine it's gonna be awesome and i hope i have enough money to actually like upgrade some of my gears which is probably not because i had to use 30,000 on the goddamn rune right which was a waste of money <laughs> uh, it was not worth it one bit I do like the one I put on my, uh, on the, uh, on the armor piece, so I guess that was, but it was so expensive. I am really surprised they asked for that much, and it's pretty hard to get that much money, like, yeah. Yeah, it, it really, uh, well, I do have tons of stuff I can sell, so I guess, uh, I guess it doesn't matter too much. Prices are super high. For that thing here, yeah, the run right, I, I had I used 30,000 to uh to upgrade it fully. I was surprised. That was like all of my money. Easily. In any case, I am done. Thanks a lot for watching everyone. Hope you enjoyed it as I much as I did. And I'll see you all next time. Have a great day.